Hello, you lovely ladies and gentlemen. Uh, how are you doing today? Welcome to chapter 29. Oh boy. How screwed am I? <laughs> How screwed am I, ladies and gentlemen? How screwed am I? Find out in this episode of uh, Under the Saga Iron Man. Uh, hello, everybody. Hello, Nameless X. Hello, Serlif. Hello, Thalso. Hello, your waifu. Hello, Goose. Hello, the lucky loser. Hello, Freefall. Hello, Dentrust. Hello, Jekuman. Uh, hello, the Lord. Hello, DS Noon. Hello, Alfred. How are you guys doing today? I am doing fine. I was out in Oslo today with Bethany and her parents. We walked around. Now I'm kind of tired, but I still wanted to stream. That's great, you know? It's not like I need to be well rested to be chapter 29, right? Oh boy. This is probably the hardest chapter of the game, and I have like 14 units. That's gonna be fun. Mm -mm. Hello, late egg. Manx, you are screwed. You are screwed, Anako. You are screwed. I will pull through. I believe in myself. I believe this can be done. I believe I can beat Chapter 20. Now, how hard can it be, ladies and gentlemen? How hard can it be? It's not that hard. <laughs> go quell, go quell. Just be sure to check ranges. Dude, every the field is just gonna be red, you guys. 50% of the time, Manx dies 100% of the time on Chapter 29. Yeah, I guess that's how it works. But Arena, run to 5 bucks. It's Chapter 29 time. How many will we lose today? Hopefully no one, because I need everyone for the final battle. I'm going to get murdered in the final battle. <laughs> I am going to get murdered in the final battle if I, I I can't lose any more units. It needs to be Deathless Stream today, ladies and gentlemen. We need, we need to have Deathless Stream today. It's very important. We absolutely need to have Deathless Stream today. Alright, let me turn on something. I'm gonna see if it works properly. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, let's see if this works here. Alright. Focus mode, ladies and gentlemen. We need we need focus. Does I got 50k gold? I should I should be able to get it, yeah. Because I sold every single bow I had, because I have no more bow users available. Mang's getting the original ending. <laughs> Chapter 29. Uh, against all odds. Against all odds. Uh. With Castle Malachor successfully taken, Jaka prepares to march on the capital. However, mere hours later, the same day, a scout arrives with worrying news. Do you have a Luna Tome? You'll need it. There's no Luna Tomes in Amadon Saga. I mean, there are enemy Luna Tomes. General Jokka, I bring important news. You have to read this at once. Sounds serious. I'll take a look at it. Go get some rest. You look exhausted. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Anyway, bad news. Hopemeyer's just declared independence from Amadon. Now Mortimer is marching east with Galad Steel Knights. He planned to put Holtmeyer and its people to the torch. Even Randall wouldn't have gone that far. Is this re uh, intel reliable? I sent out my most trusted men to keep an eye on Mortimer. We can't let that bastard kill thousands of innocents. Aren't you too invested in Holtmeyer's fate, Jaka? Don't tell me you have family living there or something. What, you do? My mother and sister. It's possible Mortimer knows where you've hidden them. This is likely to be a trap. We can't simply throw all our plans away for your family. If we go, we'll be letting the king lead us by our noses. We've accumulated a great deal of military momentum. I think we owe it to Jaka to try and save his family. He's done so much to help each one of us. I agree. But this could ruin all we that we worked for. He'll ru we'll rush to Holtmeyer and form additional plans along the way. Let's start reviewing our backup contingencies now, just in case. Fine, but if our invasion goes up in smoke, it was your fault. I'll accept that burden. We all will. Oh boy. Fearing for the fate of Holtmeyer, Jaka's army marches with all haste to the east. They are able to read the, reach the trade city in time to protect it against King Mortimer. 
When they arrive, the gates swing open, and they are welcomed as friends. Hopemeyer citizens relish the thought of freeing themselves from House Steel. Ah, <laughs> uh, wait, Bethany? Bethany, where are you typing from? She must be in the bedroom or something. Alright. Jocka, it's good to see that you're alive. We heard that your army was, was approaching. It's good to see you too, Brandon. How are things here in Holtmeyer? Chaotic. A lot of things have happened this past week. Or so my mates report to me, I only sailed back today. We obtained reports saying the city has declared independence. Why would they want to do that? Aren't they scared of Mortimer? That's the thing, boy. I don't think these rumors are organic. Holtmeyer has nothing to gain from declaring independence. We must keep up good relations with Umbaran's noble class. This is only going to enrage and turn them all against us. What are you saying, then? The rumors are lies? I think the Thieves' Guild is behind all of this. They're stirring up the citizenry for some reason. The sentiment is spreading fast, beyond our control. I see. Where's my mother and sister? Can you take me to see them? I didn't want to upset Ella in her condition. She and Femke are still living at your house. I have my boy Jim Jim keeping an eye on them. Alright, let's make sure they are fine. I have a bad feeling. I'll read donations after the narration, by the way. Mother, Femke! Where are you? Answer me! Divines, I smell a corpse. Jaka, look under the table. It's Jim Jim. Someone killed one of my sailors. Slip into a Jim Jim! Or sorry, snap into a Jim Jim. Damn it, Brandon. I thought you were keeping them safe. What the hell happened here? Must have been the Thief's Guild. This is Miss Aubrey's handiwork. I don't see your mom and sister anyway. They must have been... Look, there's a note on the table. We have your family. Don't do anything stupid, Jaka. No, 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 no! Should have taken more precautions. Lord of Lances, come outside and look, hurry! Huh? Let's go check it out. Mother of the Dawn. Uh-oh! Stinky! Ashburn Axe Knights. But why did we not see them on the way here? Were they skulking in the woods, waiting for our arrival? I think you're about to get your answers. Look over there, Jaka. Someone's approaching. Oh yeah, if I surrender, I guess the Iron Man is over, right? Rebel dogs, your days are numbered. I am Commander Galahad, hear me. Surrender right now or the city will become our burial sites. Your burial site. You all fought admirably for a ragtag pack of scrawny vermin. Take pride in the fact that you were able to breach Andalon's borders. But it all ends here. We've secured ourselves some valuable hostages. I'm not gonna pull it. Brother, help me, I'm so scared. Well, that was a very convincing performance. And so it's going to be all right. Don't cry, little Femke. Jocko will save us. I'm not polling whether or not I'm gonna end my Iron Man. Adorable, aren't they? Here's the deal. We'll trade these two for General Jocka. Okay, fine. I'll pull it. I'll pull it. But I won't listen to you. Fine, fine, you, you get your stupid pole, okay? You get, <laughs> you'll get your stupid pole. There you go, guys. He can choose his family or his life. Fake democracy? Ah, oh, yeah, my favorite kind. Mother of Femke, this cannot be. Damn those cowardly snakes. Where's their sense of honor? Piss on their honor, Jack. I do not accept those terms. They have my family, Darius. I have to do something. You walk out that gate, you're a dead man. They will probably murder your family anyway. You just said it yourself. They have no honor. What, you're gonna take Mortimer at his word? Damn it, what should I do? Oh, gee, I wonder what chat's gonna vote. Oh, yeah, yeah, look at that. 57% yes, yeah. 57% of chat just want me to say yes. Very funny, chat. You're all fools. If you think I would ever trust you traitors. Please forgive me, mother. Femke, there's nothing I can do. Guess I couldn't expect such an easy solution. Very well, Lord of Lances, you made your choice. I knew this wouldn't work. Jaka isn't a simple man. Shall I kill these two, my liege? Please, if you must strike us down, then leave my do- There's no need to worry, miss. I'm not like Lady Cassandra. 
I won't hurt innocent citizens. You'll just become a chess piece. A chess piece? Uncle Galahad, take these two to the location on this map. Then you can await my orders. We'll let Jaka take the bait. If he somehow survives this day, I'll have another card to play. You villain, you would toy with our lives? Divines curse you. Very good, my league. I'll take care of this matter personally. Woman, you're on the girl. Come with me. Don't get feisty. Whenever Steel Knights move, you hear Pegasus wings, and we've never been able to figure out why. What causes this? this is the weirdest bug. Galahad has taken my mother and sister away from the battlefield. What in the blazes is going on? Is this some psychological trick? Some kind of evil, twisted ploy by Mortimer to get inside my head? I won't hurt innocent citizens, just sell them to Stixie and Slavers. Okay, no one said it was perfect. Count yourself lucky, lad. No sense in overthinking it. Anything at all is better than Mortimer just killing them. Maybe there's a chance you can get them back. In that case, we have to do everything we can to survive this battle. We need to beat back these attackers and pursue Galahad as soon as we can. My boys are telling me that the civilians are currently gathering in the tower in the hall. I will go and protect it personally so you and men, your men can focus on the fighting. Yeah, I guess it's finally time for the second siege of Hopemire. Whatever happens, we must hold! Okay, here we are. 13 out of 17, God help us. 13 out of 16, actually. God help us. Wait, did it not remember my battle preps? Uh, give me a second. Pretty sure I did, uh, I'm pretty sure I did a battle. Sorry, I, 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 I played around a little bit with, with battle preps before, before stream. Taint, 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 taint. Wait, it didn't? Really? Ah, oh, there we go. There we go. Yeah, that's better. That's better. Tain, 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 tain. Loading the rigged run. Yeah, I gotta load the rigged... No, no, I haven't played any. I just... I literally just, like, sorted my inventory out before stream. That's all I did. Tain, 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 tain. Loading the crit patch. Yeah, I, I guess. I guess. Yeah, yeah. Look, I... I spent like 30 minutes cleaning out my convoy, okay? I'm not gonna do that shit on stream. Classic taint. Let him have this, he's gonna die anyway. Alright, so, uh, let me show you my team. I have Jaka, I'm contemplating giving him an eternal seal, even though he's capped strength, skill, and speed, just because I want him to get more luck, defense, and resistance. Um, Darius is still pretty good, I'm glad I have him. Helga is really damn good. I'm glad I have her. Tendaris is insane. I, I don't think he'll need an Eternal Seal to become good. I think he's going to cap most of his stats anyway. Um, Varg is also amazing. Look at him. He's going to cap his magic. Sari is still here as well. Glad I kept her alive. Dawn is incredible. Look at this woman. 38 magic. John is coming along very nicely. He's still a little slow, but he's still amazing. 19 defense as a bishop. That's crazy. Cyrus... Yasta Hellblazer, thank goodness. Lilinette is also amazing, she's about to cap again. Caroline, we're gonna get the regalia, but you guys know what I noticed? She doesn't have a freaking sword! I need to trade her sword rank! No! Oh, this annoyed me so much. Oh my goodness, I gotta use her short sword and I gotta... I gotta train her up, guys. This is awful. Uh, same thing with Theodore, he doesn't have S rank in Lances yet, despite the Rose Thorn being available. So I'm gonna have to literally train his, uh, Lance rank up. Which is so annoying. And we have Aisha, of course, who is also incredible. Do you not have any- Oh, Scimitars! Scimitars! You're right, Sim- Sim- Scimitars, not Scimitars. You're absolutely right, you're absolutely right. I don't need to use short swords. I have Scimitars. Scimitars. Scimitars, Scimitars. You are absolutely right, ladies and gentlemen. I need to get that weapon rank up. Simpitar, yeah. So this is how we're gonna spread out. Um, we're gonna have Caroline run up here, and she's gonna deal with these guys. I'm gonna put her on a fort, probably. And she's just gonna tank. I think mo these guys have bows, sadly, which is incredibly annoying. 
but these guys do not, so at the very least, like a couple of rounds of combats against these guys, and Caroline should re reach S rank in swords. I think what I'm gonna do, see, so one, two, three, four, five, six, I'm gonna dance for her with Sari so I can go get the Claymore. Uh, Caroline needs to move on the armory, unlike. Wait, what? Oh, she needs to move on the armory? Really? What armory? Are you sure? No, PH, you're fucking with me. No, PH, you're fucking with me. No, PH, you're fucking with me. He he's trying he's trying to screw me over. No, it's no. No. He he check the code if you don't believe. Yeah, I'm gonna check and then you're gonna say, haha, made you look. No, um, I, I will actually check, because I want to see if he's fucking with me. Because if, if he has changed it... He isn't joking, really? Listen to PH. PH misinformation. You see, this is why I can never trust you, PH, because you lie 50% of the time. You see, this is why people... You see, PH, this is why people cannot trust you. Because you lie 50% of the time. Which is the worst kind of liar. If you lied all the time, I could know never to trust you. And that would have been nice. But you lie 50% of the time, so I always have to double check. Alright, let me check. Uh, let's see. I I have to check this. Okay, he's actually not wrong. No, uh, so Victoria needs to visit the armory, and Caroline needs to visit the shop. So, PH was right, but as always, it was a 50% lie. He was right that one of them needs to go on the armory. But he was wrong about the kind of armory. Like, no. But Caroline goes here. You see? You see what I'm talking This This fucking Frenchman right here? He, he can never be honest. He can never be honest. He lies 50% of the time. It's the worst. Alright, anyway, we gotta read some donations here. Zero Anonymous donated five bucks for Super Chat. General Manx, you have an important donation. You need to read it at once. It says, have a nice day. Thank you, Sir Anonymous. I have a thank you for wishing me a nice day. Alfred, King of Wessex, donated five bucks for super chat. Hey, Egg, I'm back. Ugh, <laughs> I'm just joking. Um, I heard you and Bethany are getting married. My condolences. JK, congrats to you both. I hope you have a wonderful life together. Thank you, King Alfred. Wholesome message from you. All right, ladies and gentlemen. Oh boy, I'm not ready for this. I'm not ready for this. I am not ready for this. Okay, what, what, what are they selling here? Oh, they're selling dark spikes, but they're so expensive though. I, I don't... So, here's the thing. I probably want to get some gold in the arena. So, I'm thinking about... Um, I'm thinking about who to send in. I mean, Dawn is probably a good target to send into the arena, I imagine. Da 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 Dawn can go into that arena, and then I don't know who to send into the other arena. I mean, Helga is probably a good idea. I can send Ahmed in the arena, honestly. That's kind of funny. One, two, three, four, five, six. Summon. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. You can actually send Ahmed into the arena. It's actually really funny. Like, he can earn money and everything. Manx, you have 13 out of 16 units and you want arena. Yes. <laughs> Absolutely. fucking -lutely. Maybe Aisha. Aisha's pretty damn good in the arena, actually. She's actually really good in the arena. Right, I'm gonna send Varg. Uh, Varg is gonna run down here and heal. That's what he's gonna do. Tendaris is... Okay, so let's take a look. We have Mungnus right here. Uh, and then we have a commander. And then we have Joffrey with the Ash Cleaver. He needs to die fast. And not Ariel for this map. Would have loved to have Ariel. Yeah, the enemies of this map are bonkers. They're absolutely bonkers. They're like nearly camped. I have 53,000 gold, so if I get a little bit, I can buy a little bit from the shops. Like, uh, they sell very good items here. Like, they sell brave weapons, which is nice. I do have a lot of them, though, so it should be fine. Where's Mang's self-insert? What? What are you talking about? What? I don't have a self insert. Okay, well, aside from Boogie, that is. Check Morty and Brianna. Uh, they won't be here at the start. But here's Morty. He has a light brand. 
Alexander actually has his ma- he will have his gladiolus later, I think. But Brianna has this funny little item. You gotta kill all the Hallbringers before you kill her. So, uh, that's annoying. My grandma just asked me why I'm watching an egg guy. Um, tell her that uh, he's a very nice guy. That was so. That's, I'm very good with grandmothers, actually. Very good with grandmothers. All right. You can kill her even with the seal. Yeah, it's possible. It's not. It's not impossible. You're right about that. Uh, what's the lore here in this map? Like, play the game. Do uh, you want me to explain to you the entire backstory of Amadeus? Jesus. All right. So I think uh, with uh, Theodore. Elwind is definitely an option. I do think he wants the Rose Thorn in his inventory, though, so that if he can use it, it'd be very nice to be able to use it. So what's the Strat Manx, if you even have one? Uh, it, it, try not to die. All right. Brandon is protecting the civilians in the town hall. Do not let him fall, or you will get a game over. Everything is ready, Your Majesty. We can begin the siege at any time. All the ships have been burned, and my and we have the entire city surrounded. The Thieves' Guild will open Holtmeyer's gates when we give them the signal. The Lord of Lance's forces are doomed. Good. We'll let the Ashborn Axe Knights charge ahead first. You don't want me to coordinate the Spare Knights alongside them? No. We will let Ashborn cut a path through the enemy's defenses. Hold back your elite cavalry until Wind, Lance, and Rose have arrived. Peculiar strategy, my king? I'm just choosing which of the noble houses will incur the biggest losses. That I can get behind. And what about the troops for House Flameguard? House Flameguard suffers so many losses defending the wall. Their soldiers would be the last to enter the battlefield. Then I will go ahead and tell them to prepare for battle. Brianna, we talked about this. You were in no condition to lead. My mother and brother are dead. Only I remain to lead our house. You cannot expect our soldiers to fight without a leader, can you? Their moral will plummet. Brianna, please think for two seconds. I cannot risk you fighting out here. Think of your condition. Think about our future. It's not worth the risk. As your king, I command you to stand down. Alexander can take charge. Very well, but allow me to speak to the troops at least. Alright, I'll be heading to the Lumina Shrine. M meet up with me later. Be safe, your majesty. By sunset, I promise you that every one of these invaders will be dead. Anbaron will finally be free. I hope you're right. Uh-oh. Ashburn Axe Knights, prepare to charge! Paint the city red with rebel blood! That's the signal. Thieves Guild, open the gates at once. Damn it, this is exactly as we feared. The Thieves Guild is sabotaging us. Everyone, brace yourself for combat. This is going to be a brutal battle. And so it begins. The great battle of our time. Ah. Woo! Oh, I should have given Cyrus a hammer. Just realized this now. <laughs> or we could let John take charge here. Yeah. All right. Well, first things first. So a descendant of Claymore finally seeks me out. I have come seeking the lost regalia of my house. My grandfather lost it to you while gambling. I'd like it back. Aye, I always knew someone would come for it one day. I'll pay you for the sword. Just name your price. No need. Ever since I won this cursed sword, I've heard nothing but misfortune. Surely the divines are punishing me for some reason I don't understand. Please just take this damn thing. Thank you so much. And we get the claymore, ladies and gentlemen, and the lucky seven skill. So, we can't use it yet, but here it is. Claymore, the hidden regalia. It's a devil weapon, by the way. Uh, 18 might, 80 hit, 20 crit, grants duelist blow, 10, 10 luck, 10 speed. So, here it is. I think we just want to dark him up this shit. So, the question is... Can Caroline... Okay, we have a halberd here already, my goodness. I'm thinking if we put Caroline right here, with the scimitar, she should be able to deal with this guy at least. He does have a sword weaver, which is not great, but uh, at the same time, I mean, what can we really do? 
What is Caroline's luck? Uh, she has 29 luck. Oh, hi there, sweetie. But yeah, we'll put Caroline right here with the scimitar, hoping to get some, uh... Hoping to get some weapon experience on her. Let's send Dawn into the arena. Or maybe we shouldn't, I don't know. We could send, we could send Ahmed into the arena. And Aisha into the arena. 550, let's go. Uh... 44 hit? God damn it. 44 hit? The fuck? Why are these guys so dodgy? Alright, okay, let's, uh... 770. Don should be able to win this, right? Easy. Does Mangs know about rescuing the green unit? I mean, yeah, you can rescue Brandon, this is true. But where are you gonna put him? Do leadership stars affect the arena? I think they do, yeah. I think they also go for the enemy, though. Yeah, we could probably do high bet dawn. I, I agree with that. Alright, so here we have... We have a bunch of Brave Axes and Halberds, but uh, if Lilinet and Theo face these guys together, then I do believe we should be fine. Tendarius can absolutely massacre these guys, especially if he has a Helga support, it should be absolutely fine. But uh, I want to be a bit cautious with Lilinet and Theodore too. But uh, Tendoris has camp defense and the Helga support. Also, I gotta actually remember. I gotta remember to pop this support as well. So most of these guys have... Uh, I think, yeah, every single one of them actually has... Yeah, every single one of them have melee weapons, so... I guess we just Hellblazer it up or we do the Brave Sword. Man, can, you st can you stop streaming? I need to go have a leak. Sure. Sorry about that. Mm -mm. Hellblazer? It does deal magic damage, which is nice. But yeah, we'll put Cyrus right here. Maybe we should just fire off the Hellblazer on the first turn. It is nice to keep it, though, but it is also magic damage, so... You know what? I think this is fine. Alright, here we go. Are you alright, John? You look wary. I'm surprised we're still alive. These battles are intense. I've seen you go through worse. Are you sure it's nothing else? I have a bad feeling about the future of House Flameguard. What kind of bad feeling? That some other house may rise up to challenge our rule. Whatever happens, we will do our best to stop it. Just like we stopped the rise of Cassandra? We won't allow something like that to happen again. I don't mean to be negative, but I have a feeling that, that payment is due for our actions. Whatever that payment is, my friend, we will face the consequences. I'm not running away anymore. Alright, whatever it is, we'll face it together. Together. And that actually teaches Cyrus Aegis. So, uh, Cyrus has both P Pavice and Aegis right now, which is pretty good. Does Manx know that the green unit can be rescued? Yeah, of course. Yes. Yes, of course I know. Alright, Jaka, get, get down here. Yeah, I just popped an Eternal Seal on Jocko, I don't care. And, uh, I would prefer... So, I know one of these guys... I, I don't think there's any Dragon Slaying Axes here. No, there's no Dragon Slaying Axes here. So, if we put Tendaris... The boss Magnus, we gotta be a bit careful about this guy. He does hit pretty hard, but Helga should be able to deal with him, I think. Especially if we put Tendaris right here with the Magic Stone. Oh, that's kind of cool, actually. I can put Helga right here. <laughs> yeah, I can put Helga right here. That's actually a safe spot. And then I think Theodore and Lilinette can uh, stand together right here. 
I don't know which one of them should, uh... I think I will actually, uh... I, I really don't know what to do with Darius here, but... We gotta, we gotta be ready for the, uh, the assassins that are gonna pop up next turn, so... I think maybe just retreating here is fine. Mangs, who made this chapter? This is a PH chapter. Too bad we don't have any horse slayers. Oh, we have lots of horse slayers. What are you talking about? Theodore might actually be very good against the assassins, I think. Even though his hit rate may be a little low, we'll see. But we'll keep Amon and Darius around. Alright, here we go. Alright. Cyrus sweep, let's go. Oh ho 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 ho. Mm -mm. Let's go. Sadly, it's not a kill. Uh, but dealing with the commanders early is a nice strategy. Reduce the reduce the enemy leadership stars effectively. Ah, oh, no crit from Cyrus. Honestly, John might be better at dealing with these guys than Cyrus is. All right, here we go. Eclipse the Sword Reaver. That's fine though. Okay, very nice. No crits from Caroline, as of yet. But she just needs to get weapon rank so she gets S rank in swords, that's all that matters. Oof. Oof. Ow! This guy hits hard, what the hell? Does the scimitar give extra weapon experience? Yeah, it gives a lot, it gives like five. Hit points, strength, skill. Oh, lovely. It's a good Tandy level up right here. That's a good Tandy level up right here. Woo! There's another commander. Come on, Tandy, take him down. Come on, Tandy, take him down. No crits from Tandy, okay. This is the Mang self-insert. Everyone on about how boogie is my self-insert. No, that guy's a self-insert. The Great Raijin donated a five bucks to Super Chat. Hey, Mangs, I'm not caught up on your streams yet, but I have to be here for Chapter 29. Good luck. Yeah, this is gonna be a big one. Okay, I was hoping Tendaris would kill more guys, but okay. Yay, green units, let's go, woo! Ah, uh, who are these people? Have they come to help us? Oh, nice. Oh, thanks for taking my kills. I appreciate it. Okay. <laughs> Good green units right here. Let's go. Oh, what a, what a, what a bunch of helpful green units you are. Lightbringer energy. Let's go. The bishops will probably heal Tendi. Or, you know, they could heal Cyrus, who is missing 4 HP. That's great. So why the fuck are Lightbringers here? They're Lightbringer loyalists. They're they're like sympathetic to the Lightbringer regime. They've been hiding. So there are still Lightbringer loyalists occupying Hulkmire. All right then, assassins, get them and bring out the saboteurs. All right now, now it begins. No, now it ends. All right. Well, Jaka boy. Oh my goodness, he doesn't double the assassins. Alright, so I think... Lilinette next to Theo has 99 avoid. But these guys still have like a 30% chance to hit her, which is really scary. Let's see, can Caroline kill this guy? She has a good chance to crit, but I feel like it's probably a good idea to get her onto a fort. Let me see... I need to see these guys hit rate with bows. 85 plus 22, so that's like 120 hit. Caroline with the scimitar has... Let's see, how much weapon did experience did she get from that? Quite a bit. Is this it? Is this all you can conjure, Mortimer? Boom. <laughs> so I guess what we could do is we could send Theodore here. Uh... Use a kill with Elwyn? Oh, no! 
But we have Darius with Dark Spikes. Wait, he doesn't have Dark Spikes? Why doesn't he have Dark Spikes? That's awful. Yeah, my, my units are a little bit out of position, as you can see right here. Not great. Manx, I found out how to get Randall. I'm so tired of the Randall comments. Guys, you got bamboozled. Randall isn't playable. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, guys. Alright, Caroline, you deal with them. I guess we'll just let Dawn clean up this assassin. Kinda want Darius down there to deal with the uh, with the Axe Knights. Mengs lied as easily as he breathed. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Okay, where else are the assassins at? We got an assassin right here. Ooh. Yeah, I think... Brave Land's time for Cyrus. Yeah, Brave, Brave Land's time for Cyrus, for sure. Honestly, I think... As much as I like the Hellblazer... Why do you not have Dark Spikes on him? I have no idea. No, he totally isn't recruitable, wink wink. Yeah, don't believe everything you hear online, guys. Don't believe everything. Okay, how how's oh my goodness. Yeah, John does not deal with these guys well at all, does he? Absolutely not. I mean these guys will weapon triangle me no matter what I do, won't they? So Okay, we can Hmm. So where's the other guy? He went down here. very hard to kill these guys. I'm kind of kind of in shock. I guess we'll do a uh, we'll do a fiery chant on dawn, why not? Egg, you have Dolem on Darius. Yeah, that was a bit of a mistake, I guess. I could kill him with Unga Unga the Bali, but I would need to take it off him, I think. Or I could just let them go for Darius, I mean, hmm. I feel like Lilinette would be able to tank this. Uh, she, she would, on the fort, she would definitely have the avoidance to do it. So I think what I'll do is I'll put her here. Maybe I'll even rescue the green unit up. Okay, so I, I don't want them all to gang up on the green units. I think what I'm gonna do, and this may seem a bit weird, but... So, I think what I'm gonna do, actually, is I'm gonna rescue him, put him up here, and then I'm gonna have Lilinette drop him up here. I know, I, it seems a bit weird, but I promise you guys that it will it will make a lot of sense. One, two, three, four, five, wait. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Then he won't be able to get off, so actually, no. Oh, Dola miss effective, you're right. Yeah, that's like, that's a good point, actually. Yeah, look at that. I don't know about this. Yeah, me neither. I, I kind of want to keep the green units alive, though. That's the thing. I really want to keep the green units alive, but if we look at how well they deal with Lilinette... Yeah, look at that. They one-shot her. So, <laughs> they're kind of scary. They're kind of scary. Oh, we got more. We got... Oh, my goodness. It's not going so well down here, either, is it? Aisha, please tell me you, you kill these guys in one shot. Fuck. And here comes this guy as well. Can Aisha even withstand this assault? This looks to be kind of scary. Well... Maybe I can just nost... Okay, here's the question. Oh my god, look at Helga. She just barely doesn't kill Joffrey. She just barely does not kill Joffrey. Oh boy. So Joffrey can attack over here. But, okay, so this is actually safe for Varg. I'm thinking Void Flare is probably... Oh my goodness, no! Oh boy. Okay, what about you? Why does she not have Ragnarok on her? Why the fuck does she not have Ragnarok? This is bad. I forgot how, I forgot how menacing these guys can be. It's... Dicer? I think Dicer is probably our best bet, yeah. 
yeah, it's definitely our best bet, but it's still not great. One of the Ash Knights can attack over here. Joffrey can attack over here. We cannot let her deal with Joffrey. That would be too bad. So let's just dice her right up here and hope she either gets a crit. There you go. We do need some kind of response to Joffrey, though. I'm thinking Darius... Darius Nosferatu is probably our best bet here. So far, so good, Manx, but unfortunately, I gotta run. Okay. Manx, the best response to Joffrey was killing him in Chapter 11. Ah, that's a good point. So these green units will probably die. <laughs> But, uh, maybe I can... Okay, so there's a commander here. Yeah, I think... Hmm. What kind of weapons do they have? They have Brave Axis. No more Halberds, at least. So, maybe it is safe to put Lilithite here? They'll probably go for her. Yeah, I probably have no choice. But I have to trade the Abungo Bali away from him, so... I think it's probably better to do this. Here's the thing, though. Darius on a four. He has ni only 19 defense. Yeah, he has to Nosferatu do it up. It's the only way he survives. But maybe, just maybe, Theodore can deal with a few of these guys with the short land just to get just to get uh, like at least the commander away. I don't see any. Uh, I don't see any uh, any halberds or anything like that. As long as Theodore is in range should be able to, to do this. Alright, so we can kill two of these guys. And then, is there like a safe spot for Helga? Yeah, she can actually hide, a, hide here. So, this is actually fine. Preserve Theo. If he survives and get Alastor, you win. This is true, actually. I don't actually need the Rose Tarn. What the fuck? I get the Alastor in this chapter. Like, what, what do I need the Rose Tarn for? That's actually a good point. Yeah, look at this. Look look at the safe spot for Helga right now. Look at the safe spot for Helga. This is amazing. I got punished. Alright, so that's a couple leadership stars gone. Very nice. Magic, luck, defense. Let's go. And then I think the remaining guys will not be able to kill Tendaris. Especially not if he elixirs it up. I think regular Dragonstone might work here. Nah, the Magic Stone is still better, actually, because but they'll probably kill the green units before they do anything else, so I think I'll put Tendaris up here. I'll keep the Magic Stone on him, pop an elixir. And Varg, good old Varg. Uh, yeah, I really don't... Mm. He does have a... I really don't like this guy. I really don't. I don't want him to kill the bishop. I am contemplating rescuing the bishop with uh, John, because keeping these bishops alive is actually really nice. Like they heal your, they heal your guys. So I'm thinking actually I might do that. Yeah, I, I, you know what? This may seem a bit stupid, but I actually think it's a good idea. And then we want to bring Varg down to where Joffrey's at, because that Void Flare can mess him up. Oh, nice. S-rank. Yeah, good, nice try, Clock. I'm not going to fall for that shit. Not going to fall for that shit, Clock. Banking on a green unit to heal. Hey, man. Hey, man. You got to save all the green units you can on this chapter. Alfred, King of Wessex, donor two bucks for Super Shot. I blame you for my Pepsi Max addi addiction. Good. Mm -hmm. oh, wait, Cyrus doesn't have Pub Ice anymore. Ah, shit. Uh oh. Oh no, Cyrus doesn't have Pub Ice anymore. Oh, Cyrus doesn't have Pub Ice anymore, you guys. 
Uh, that's bad. Hit point skill rest, okay. But that's the commander, though. And Cyrus won't kill this guy, so this is fine. Yeah, I need to use my... I really need to use my uh, my health blazer against these guys. This is fine, though. He's not going to kill these generals from full health, and none of them have hammers, to my knowledge, so this is fine. Alright, skill on Cyrus. This is fine. You see? It's fine. But yeah, the the helper, the Hell Blazer is definitely the play here, for sure. Now, I just hope the Bishop will heal Cyrus, and not some other stupid unit. That way I can attack with John, which would be very nice. No! Randall is not recruitable! Shut up about Randall! My goodness! <laughs> he backfired! He backfired! Oh, the Ashburn Axe Knight backfired. That's amazing. Oh, that's that's hilarious. Oh my goodness. Cyrus could have totally died here. He could have absolutely fucking died here. This is the scariest enemy face theme in the game. Oh yeah, it is. Alright, Caroline. Come on, Caroline. Get that S rank in swords. Get that S rank in swords. I believe in you. Come on, a couple crits would be very nice here. A couple of crits would be very nice here. <laughs> the trick is to make him blue, yeah. This is how you recruit Randall, ladies and gentlemen. You hack the game. Hit points, magic, luck, and resistance. Let's go. Just need that S rank in swords, guys. Just need that S rank in swords. Then she can start using... Oh, very good, very good, very good, very good. Ooh. Yes! Here we go, we got the Claymore. I mean, we're not probably gonna use it that much, but... Oof. Oof. Yeah, fuck the short lance, man. Like, I don't need it. I get the Alastor in this chapter. I, I get the Alastor, like, the, 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 the Rose Thorn sucks. Why do I, why do I, why am I trying to train Theo up to use it? My goodness. Alright, looks like this Lightbringer guy might be okay. Maybe, it depends on what the other guy has. Depends on what the last guy has. Aww. Aha! Let's go, Lightbringer Chan! Let's go! Oh boy. That's a scary group of units right there. That is very scary. Alright. And we got this Lightbringer Chan as well. Two of them are gonna go for him for sure. Brave Axe incoming. And he gets hit twice. What the hell? Oh my goodness. He gets hit twice? Is the last one gonna reach him? No, they're gonna go for tendies. The assassin might get him though. They look like this they look like Butch and Harkin, I guess they are. Manx, don't forget that once you beat the game, you're going to tell people how to recruit Kellic from The Last Promise. I will never tell people. Okay, here we go. No, Lightbringer Chan! Oh my god! Oh my god! The green units! The green units are caring! Amazing! Wow. The green units are freaking caring, man! Yeah, these guys are not hitting Caroline. Yeah, we gotta get her tome up and going right now.
Uh oh. There we go. Oh no! Killing Edge! Oh, scary. I have the holy symbol on Tundaris. Thank goodness. And that's good, because these assassins are scary. I and mean, if that was like a double crit, yeah, that could have been really bad. And they're bringing down the walls. They're bringing down the walls. The walls, the walls, the walls. They're bringing down the walls. All right. Green units using elixirs. That's amazing. I think both of them will actually do this. I, fa I, I failed the secret objective, you guys. I remember when all these fuckers had lethality. Yup. Yup, Davis. During the beta testing phase, every single one of these assassins had lethality. So that was fun. Hey! I love these green units, man. If you can keep them alive, they make this map so much easier on you. It's, it's amazing. Oh boy, here comes the ring archers. Hmm, let's see if we can move around their flank. Let's hit them where they won't expect it. We gotta kill these guys right now, you guys. We gotta kill these guys. So, in case you wanna see the claymore, here it is. Pretty damn good. But, it's not too ranged, so we gotta bring out the, uh... Oh my god, she just barely doesn't kill here. What the hell? Should have given her a better tome than the Elwyn. I was gonna kill Pegasus Knights with it, but I think uh, I think even like an Elfire or a Thunder would have been better here for the crit. Yeah, so we just got visited by Mr. Uh, my Mr. Gabriel here. He has the Gale shot, 39 speed. We gotta have some kind of response for this guy. Uh, but first, we gotta kill Joffrey. That's so. I'm thinking if Aisha uses the hammer, maybe. Yeah, as you can see, Joffrey doesn't have a very high chance to, to crit, but if he uses Colossus, he'll get 35 extra damage, so that'll be that'll be a kill, but 14 chance to hit. We also have the Void Flare, who might double him? No, 43. Oh yeah, no, no, I, the, the, it sucks, I mean, but I think I don't really have any other choice but to do this. Yeah, I don't really have any other choice but to do this. And I definitely think we need to do Hellblazer Cyrus on this forest style right here. I mean... Yeah, this is really, really scary, but there's not much we can do? I mean, maybe Ahmed can kill the saboteur. <laughs> sure, why not? <laughs> Void Flare into Helga. That is an op that is an option. Uh, that is an option. Yeah, go Void. Yeah, put Varg on this tile. Hit him with the Void Flare. Then go up with Helga. I think that's probably for the best. And then then we'll do Nosferatu on Varg. I gotta be careful though. Is are they in range of Brandon? No, they're not. Okay, good. Yeah, I think we do. We do. We do Void Flare Varg. Tremble and despair, worm. You are merely fodder. Another notch in the edge of the Ash Cleaver. I love this battle quote. There we go. And then I do think Helga can ride up here with Dark Spikes and finish him off. And then we'll put... We'll put honestly, Aisha with the hammer could probably kill him, but I, I'm not going to risk it. Yeah, I'm not gonna risk it. How, how scary are these guys against I they, they can hardly hit her. So I think as long as we do this... Although I would kind of like to have her... I guess I can, with Helga, I can trade away the... Uh, I can trade away the... I can trade Varg into Nosferatu. Also, they have a support, so that... Oh, wow, she actually doesn't kill. What the fuck? She doesn't kill right away. I would not risk a Colossus proc. Me neither. But actually, now that I think about it, she can trade... I really don't want to concede this fourth tile to the Ashborn X Knights. I would love, but I also need to trade away Varg's Tome. So I know she has Gale Force. I know, but I would like to trade Varg's Tome and then run away with Helga if that makes sense. Because Helga needs to be in range of tendies. I, I know she has Gale Force, but then I would have to spend. Uh, I guess I can. 
Oh, maybe Dulam? Yeah, that's a... Does she have Dulam? Oh, she does. That's still not a... Um... Gale Force Trade, then Kanto. Yeah, yeah, okay, but you guys don't understand... You, you guys don't seem to understand my problem here. So, I want Helga to kill Joffrey, and then on her Gale Force, I want her to move back. I would like her to kill an Axe Knight, too, if possible. But I guess that's not really possible, is it? So... Yeah, I guess, I guess we just can't do that. Attack from the fort, bro. Yeah, yeah, but that... Yeah. I love it when chat just doesn't understand my problem. But I, I'm, I'm giving up trying to explain it. Uh, but yeah, I, I guess I could just use my counter to trade him. Yeah, I could do that. You can move one space up after killing Joffrey. Yeah, yeah. You're not... You, you, you don't understand why... Okay, let, okay, let me try to explain this to you in a way that your ADHQ brain can, 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 IQ brain can understand. I would have liked to move up with Helga, kill Joffrey, trade Nosferatu, and then Gilforce back, kill a knight, stand next to Chicken Tendis. I can't do that. Unless I'm willing to face Joffrey in close combat, which I definitely do not want to do. But I am... I, I give up. I give up, chat. I give up, chat. You're just yelling Kanto at me. Kanto! As if that, like, fixes anything. Like, just... Just yell Kanto at me. <laughs> just yell Kanto in chat. That'll fix it. That'll fix it. Kanto! You must be strong indeed to have felt me in battle. <laughs> no matter how strong one gets, there's always someone stronger. Google it, Manx. Alright, Helga is capped out. She got a whole point of rest out of it. That's nice. La, la. What a nice axe. We'll never use it. So, what we'll do now is I'll have to trade... Bargain the Nosferatu, and then I have to move down to probably this spot. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna have to do, because Varg will die if he has the Void Flare equipped. And then we'll move down. Oh shit, what was it? Was it this spot? Ah oh, fuck, where was the where was the safe spot again? Yeah, it was this it was this spot, right? Yeah, it was this spot. Yeah, Aisha will be fine, but I don't want to give the Axe Burn Ash Knights the, uh... I don't want to give them the, uh... I don't want to give them the Ford, if at all possible. Alright, Aisha will decimate these... I'm, I'm pretty sure all of them will go for Varg, but he'll just not tank. He'll just not tank them, he'll double them all, so... Skill, luck, and defense. At least that, yeah, eliminating leadership stars is, is very important on this map right here. So I think Chicken Tandis is gonna go back, he's gonna swap to his Dragonstone here. Stay within three tiles of Helga to kill this guy, and uh, the other ones are probably gonna go for the Lightbringer guy. Can't wait for the Windlands wave. Oh boy, Davis, please, let's not talk of such things. Let's not talk about the Windlands wave, okay? Alright, Kanto! <laughs> just yell Kanto at me until I figure it out, guys. Um, just yell Kanto at me until I figure it out. That's clearly how we gotta do this. Oh, nice, that's actually a kill. Look at that. But I don't know why I put these Elwyn tomes on Theodore, like... It would be much better to, like, put a thorn on him. I do have Jaffa here, though, so I could maybe give him a better one. Kanto! If we yell Kanto at him much enough, then he'll, he'll figure it out eventually. Alright, Caroline will clear up those guys, that's fine. Um, I don't really know what to do with Jaka in this situation, but uh, I don't think these guys can zoom around here, so... I think we will just physic up Cyrus, and then we'll put Cyrus Hellblazer in the woods and uh, hope for Pavice Brox, basically. That's probably how we're gonna have to do it. 
yeah, we'll put him in the woods next to his good friend. We'll equip the Hellblazer and we'll pray. That's that's gonna be how we do it. Dawn, when Dawn doesn't even kill anymore, you know shit is bad. But yeah, I guess yeah, we have we have the duelum, which is good. Pick a god and pray. Alright, he's done with. Also, can we just appreciate Nameless X and his generic palettes? They they really, really added a lot to this chapter. Like the fact that each noble house have their own palettes is so good. Alright, I wonder if Jaka. Can Jaka actually wait? No, he can't reach. I can rest. No, I don't even have the rescue staff on Luminat. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Why didn't you use Randall? Yeah, I know, man. You know, I give up. That many palettes made the ROM bigger. Palettes doesn't take up a lot of space, actually. And Lilinette is cap, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, palettes doesn't take up that much space, actually. Not as much as you'd think. Alright. Oh boy. Yeah, when when Dawn is starting to have issues, you know it's bad. Crit, please, 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 please. No? Okay. God damn it. Yeah, the Lightbringer Palettes are not great. I think maybe a mistake was made putting them in. It might be me, honestly. Da, 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 da. Okay, Caroline got that. I think we're gonna bring... I'm just gonna pop up a fire, fire chant on Jaco right now, because we know he'll need it in a bit. And uh, we need to get Theodore a much better tome. Like, uh, yeah, the Ragnarok. We have the Dire Thunder, even. Uh, I'm thinking probably like the, the the Thoron, honestly. Yeah. Screw the Rose Thorn. That shit sucks. <laughs> Who cares about the Rose Thorn? Am I right? All right, Cyrus, my man. Oh, there's the Pavis. You can't keep. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about right there. 62 crit. That's a solid support. Oh, this Pavise. It keeps proccing. No crit, sadly. I do have a Hamurn staff. I'm thinking Hellblazer might be worth Hamurning. Okay, Hellblazer. Could you get another crit? That'd be amazing. Come on. Oh, no. Cyrus doesn't necessarily kill things very fast. But slow and steady wins the race, as Jeb Bush once once said. My favorite political candidate, Jeb Bush, and his guacamole bowls, like he once said. Cyrus will choke this point. That's exactly what he does. Please clap. Gore McDonald at two bucks to Super Chat. Who took up the most space when making the ROM? Uh, animations are by far, animations are by far the most taxing thing on our own, and it's not even close. How do I recruit Jeb Bush? <laughs> yeah, animations are by far the most taxing thing, and it's not even close. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, don't you fucking dare. DON'T YOU FUCKING DARE! Not cool. Google it, I know, right? Oh, wait, he doesn't even kill? Come on, Varg. Don't be like that. Just Kanto. Yeah, Kanto. Just use Kanto! Oh, that 1% cred. That freaking 1% cred, man. Will he finish the game today? No. This, this, this stream will probably be chapter 29. I hate that 1% crit they have on him. I hate that 1% crit they have on him. I should have given him the holy symbol. Sweetie, I'm not gonna fail. Come on. 
Alright, Varg level up, let's go. Strength, magic, skill, speed. Okay, he's getting speed, that is very nice. Alright, looks like these guys want to uh, attack Lightbringer Chan. Big, big mistake though, Lightbringer Chan is the buffest guy ever. Lethal 25% hit, I sleep. Lethal 1% crit, panic. That, you got it, Abundi. You got it. This is my mental state. Alright, here we go. Oh, look at this Titan right here. Look at this Titan right here. Okay, what's the what's the assassin gonna gonna do? Let's find out. Da 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 na 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 na. Wait, is this a kill? Uh, yeah, that's a kill. Oh, Caroline, this is the best. All right, so. We've dealt with that wave now, but there's so many more. These are like the easiest wave too, and I'm kind of struggling. I, I, I really don't know how this map is going to go after... It's going to be rough. Uh, Aubrey's... Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Okay, thank goodness. I completely forgot about this guy. I completely forgot about this guy. Yeah, there comes Gabriel, too, and his Bow Knights. This is gonna suck. I'm surprised he didn't steal the, uh... I'm surprised he didn't steal the, uh, the elixir, actually. Oh, wow, this guy still lives! Holy shit, this guy still lives! Oh, no, dude, you stay away from me. You're not stealing my elixir. Oh, he ran into the water, what the hell? Wait, are you suicidal? No! Stop it! Oh my god, he's gonna get quadded! He's gonna get quadded, what are you- Oh my god, you're so stupid! You survived so much and then you do this? What an idiot. You survive all that? Well, at least my healers are idiots. Look at that. Crimson filled one at two bucks. Can't tell! Alright, here we go. We got the next wave. Oh boy. Okay. Well, so far, so good. Uh, we got Master Bows up in here. Those guys will murder John. Oh yeah, they will They will murder John. If we don't get John out of here, he's, 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 he's dead. All right, maybe a crit here, that'd be nice. Come on, Cyrus, there you go. We got Master Bows. I don't really have anyone to man the Ballista, which is kind of sad. I wish I did. Oh boy. Uh, I do have 50 gold. Okay, gold. Yeah, I do. Uh, I can I can do a gold check, but I, I have it. 100% I have it. Uh, look at this. Yeah, 54k. I'm thinking about actually just selling the scimitar and getting Caroline a better tome. I'm thinking a Thoron tome might be good for her, but a, th a Thunder tome might, might have more staying power, actually. I know buying a Thunder, like, Thorn is clearly better. <sighs> you know what? No, I, I'll i sell the scimitar and I'll get myself a... Th Thunder would last longer, though, and I feel like Thorin might be overkill on Caroline, so I'm actually going to get a Thunder tome. 
Lilinette almost died. That was terrifying. This guy wants to steal my elixir. I know what he's got in store. Uh, Gabriel is... Oh, right. He waits a turn before he charges. That's He has like a special AI where he waits a little bit. This ring commander needs to die. Oh, he's actually really beefy. I think we'll kill him with Jaka. Yeah, we'll kill him with Jaka. Just Kanto, right? Hol yeah, he wants to steal the holy symbol too, which is really scary. Oh boy, I got 788 HK. I have no idea what that is. But it's a red donation, so I think it's a lot. Use the lance? Why? I want to train Jaka's sword rank. Luck defense resistance, let's go. It's, that's a pretty big dono, isn't it? Yeah, it's red. That's how I know it's big. I think we'll prepare, we'll send Dawn over here, prepare for the... It's a hundred dollars, wow. Oh, damn. Okay, I'll read it. I, it hasn't popped up on my screen yet. I will read it when it does. Oh, yeah, we need to kill the rogue. I'm thinking Tendaris is probably really good. None of these guys have, like, worm-slaying weapons, so I think it's okay to put Tendaris here. And he does double the rogue, which is nice. Uh, but we should probably want to... We want to Gale Force with Helga first, most likely. Let's just, just use the thunder. Ron Yuan donated $100 through Super Shot. Hi, Manx. I can't believe you can go so far with more than 30 characters died, lol. I was very busy these days, so I'm still watching part 10 of the stream. I'm playing Chapter 8 slowly. Hope you will beat your own game. Faith on you, Manx. P.S. HK means Hong Kong dollars. Oh, wow. I got a Hong Kong donation. How are things going there in Hong Kong, yeah? <laughs> okay, that sounded very... That sounded very dumb. <laughs> I hope things are going well down in Hong Kong. <laughs> Hong Kong, yeah. Uh, yeah, well, don't let China hear me call it a country. That would be, uh... I mean, let, let's be real, my social credit score hit zero a long time ago. Um... Kill the assassin? Yeah, I'm gonna- I just did. And then we can, um, I want... What matters to me is that Tendaris is not in range of Gabriel, but that he is in range of these other guys. I think I'm gonna put him here. Minus tw 1,000 social credit egg. What's the inspiration from ja racist Jaka? So, uh, we didn't sit down and was like, we're gonna make him racist, but Jaka has just kind of like a... He's, he's born a commoner. His dad used to tell him scary stories of the outside world. He, so he's kind of like, he's a guarded, un untrusting individual. So he just doesn't like any... Like, Jaka's kind of rude to everyone. So in a way, he is like, he's equally racist towards everyone. So in a way, I guess Jaka's... Actually pretty pretty equal in his treatment. He's ignorant, yeah, he's ignorant. He just Jaka is suspicious of everyone and everyone. Everything. That's that's just his nature. Alright, let's uh do this with uh Varg. Dalmo's favorite character, let's go. Doo -doo. Mang's lore video series on Underdown Saga when, JK. I mean, at some point I'd love to do a, a, a video on the Noble Houses. It takes a long time to make these videos. And I, I'd like to spend some time with my fiance while she's here, you know? Uh, okay, so we need to heal Lil Nat. Uh, she's probably. Uh, okay, so we know there's a new group of people coming in here with Master Bow, Shine, Recover, Shine, Recover. So the Master Bow is scary as ball. So we want to be very careful. Um, but 26 speed, 25 speed, 33 times 2. Theodore has a holy symbol. So Theodore can probably deal with this guy. Especially if I put Lilinat behind him. 
So I think I will do that. Because a Theodore can't be crit, and this guy won't be like quadded, so. So I will put Theodore. I will pull in this guy next turn with Theodore. I'll put him here with a Thoron. Thoron will not weigh him down, that's good. I'll put Lilinette right next to him. Actually, probably won't be necessary even, because. I'll, uh, I'll barrier. Uh, she, she'll get healed by the green unit, it's fine. If Theo can, can't kill, the sniper just gets healed. Yeah, but Theo might crit. So we have some more guys. I'm thinking maybe Ahmed go up and kill that rogue. Maybe I'll even dance for Ahmed. Yeah, sure, why not? Oh, never mind. That's, there's no point. Um... I am thinking we get Darius a little bit closer into the center. Secrets video? It came out! Sami Mansur donated five bucks for Super Chat. My wife two years banned me from watching you after the incident. She walked out two weeks ago, so I'm happy to be back. <laughs> what incident? The Norwegian latrine incident? <laughs> Look. If your wife has the capacity to ban you from anything, you might you might be have to reevaluate your your choices in life. Bethany was like, told me like, when we live together, there won't be any Pepsi Max in this house. I was just like, <laughs> <laughs> I was like, that's funny, sweetie. That's funny. That's very funny. Alright, is there, is there anywhere that's safe for Helga? She does have a Purion shield, but I would prefer these guys go for Tendar. Yeah, actually, there is a safe spot right here. Although, gotta say, 29 defense. Yeah, these guys won't even do damage to him, or they'll do very little damage. So, should be absolutely safe. All right, Cyrus. Um, I read all the donuts. What? Oh yeah, it just showed up. Matt McCluskey donated five bucks for Super Chat. Manx, what do you think of some of the best things in Fire Emblem sequels has implemented? Examples: getting rid of class-specific master seals. Huh. I mean, that's one, for sure. Uh, like, some of the best features that have been implemented... I mean, there's so many. Uh, but I mean, like, how far do you want me to go back? I'd say... Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, no, we can't let them have the Ballista. We cannot let them have the Ballista. Eh, I don't like pair-up, actually. I'm not a big fan of pair-up. Oh wow, even with a crit, Theodore will not get shit done here. I mean, pair up in Fates was okay. I wasn't the big fan of it in Awakening, though. I thought I thought Awakening wasn't amazing on it. Wait, is Tendis gonna get doubled here? I think Tendis actually gonna get double here. Yeah, he is. Um, yeah, pair up is a good mechanic. I feel like they mastered it in Fates, but in Awakening I really didn't like it because it just reduced your player face, which is not great. Yeah, Fates pair up is really good. I'd say like one of the one of the best things they. I mean, I do like supports. I think uh, I think they're a mechanic that is is a good thing that they've kept them because it is really the only way we can flesh out non-main characters in the story. Uh, I like that effective damage have remained consistent, that triple might. I'm very glad we didn't, like, after Path of Radiance, it's like, yeah, double might effective damage. It's kind of garbage. And I'm glad we, I'm glad we stopped with that. Hey, you get the fuck away. Alright, good. I didn't damage her enough for their heal AI to kick in. That's cool. Harriers have arrived. Yeah, since our Jarl is dead, that's all we're getting. That's all we're getting, ladies and gentlemen.
What about the brake mechanic? I am not a big fan of the brake mechanic, gonna be completely honest. Not a big fan of the brake mechanics. I don't really feel like it added much to the gameplay at all. Oh, I love you, Lightbringer Chan. Mwah. Perfect. Now, if the other. Okay, the other one used Elixir. Uh oh. Soldiers of House Windlands, prepare for battle. Jaka, I can spot warships approaching. They're going to attack us from behind. Yeah, this is when the fun starts. This is when the fun starts. <laughs> Why no Drake cards? You don't get them in this chapter. We, we, we couldn't risk hitting the unit cap. Oh, John, why? Yeah, I'm terrified of this guy. He'll probably murder John. Yeah, look at that. He quads him. He freaking quads him. What about this guy? Okay, zero times two, though. That's actually pretty good. So, but we do we do have to get John the hell away from here. Okay, is a brave sword better in this situation? No. I think one chance at 54 crit is probably better. Come on. Come on. Urgh. Maybe rescue John. I think I have no choice at this point. Um, I wish he had a... I don't know why I didn't give him an aura. Like, why, why would I conserve stuff at this point, you know? So, how scary is this guy against Tendi? 40 damage? Actually, Tendi with Holy Symbol? Not terrible. I mean, he's gonna get doubled anyway, so honestly, Tendi's might be the be my best bet against against Gabriel. Because, I mean, the Gale Shot is only scary if he's allowed to kill stuff, right? My Jaka is grossly out of position, which is not great. Yeah, my, my Jaka is so out of position right now, this is not even funny. Uh, but I can dance for him, and I think I definitely will. Uh, okay, Caroline, can you... Okay, you can kill the longbow, but... Mang's use Kanto. <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, Theo is not great, but once he gets the Alastor... Once he gets the Alistar, it'll be okay. Uh, but one thing is for sure, I'm gonna- I have an- I have a rescue staff lying around, I think. Yeah, I have one- a one-use rescue staff. I do have an aura. This- this aura tome should go to John. I don't know why he doesn't have it. And- and the Ragnarok not being on Helga, that is such a big L. I- I don't know what I was thinking, honestly. I do have a Dire Thunder that I can give to Lilinette. That might actually be helpful in this situation. But it's very close to breaking. Mengs, in Engage, Iron Man, Kanto. Mengs in Andron Saga, no Kanto. You're, you're goddamn right, Hanako. You're goddamn right. Alright, so I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use Theo and Jaka together here against these bishops. Theo needs the Theo needs Google to learn how to use Rostar. Yeah, exactly. Mangs, do you think Alincia's Gambit is the best defense chapter ever designed? No, not by a long shot. It's a good one, but it's not the best. Uh, that would be Conquest Chapter 10. I will die on this hill. Alright. Tendorius does not get a uh, weapon. He doesn't get weapon. He doesn't get terrain bonuses. So many of my guys are out of position. I almost feel like grabbing Jaka, honestly, with Varg and getting him up to John so John can actually. Wait, do you not have rescue? Oh, John has rescue. Can John even survive this? Maybe John can rescue someone up to help. Maybe he can. Honestly, I should get Aisha up here. Can I even get Aisha up here? Let's see. I can. I can. No, wait. So I can get her here. One, two. Oh, the fucking rogue is in the way. What? Uh, 
Well, okay. Wait. If I move her up here... Okay, who can John get with the rescue staff? Oh my god, he's so... Ugh. Thirty minutes of battle preps. This is what he was late for. <laughs> uh, safe spot upwards. Oh, I can go all the way up. Yeah, that's actually a good point. Yeah, I can go up here. I can rescue Brandon. No, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> rescue Tendaris. No, 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 no. I. Tendaris needs to be here. He needs to be here. Uh, unless we wanna... I did the battle preps, the battle preps. Yeah, so... This guy murders John. We gotta get him the fuck away. I guess he can... Um... How fast is this guy? 23. I guess we'll get... If we move John over here... Heal Tendaris. I will. I will. I'm just trying to figure out how to do this in the best way possible. Uh, Thorin is not very good here. I think we want a barrier. Okay, has Jaka been barriered up? He has not. That's actually terrifying. Does Lilinette even take damage from these guys? She doesn't. So maybe Lilinette should uh, barrier up Jaka then. Yeah, I will. Okay, so... None of these guys deal damage to Lilinette, that's good, so we can put her in front, and then we can have Theo go somewhere else. Ah, Jaka's resistance is trash, guys. We don't want to let him take a bunch of magic damage. Where's Coulter's boss? She'll show up on the next turn, so... Um, we better hope that she's somewhere close to Jaka. Now, she will seek out Jaka on her own, so... Honestly, you know what? Short, short spare on Theo. Let's go. He's been barriered up. He can handle it. Wait. Are there any other units down below him? I don't think so. Send Jock up and have Theo and Lola hold the line. Yeah, I think that's probably for the best. I don't know where Aubrey's gonna spawn. We'll, we'll just have to try and rescue. We do have a rescue staff on Lilinette. Maybe we'll try to rescue him closer or something. So here we have the Windlands gang. I'm thinking just Dawn Supremacy here. She has a barrier boost and everything, or we could give her one. We have Wind Swords. Yeah, I think... I think Dawn Caller here. But here's the thing. I mean, most of these guys are magical, but that doesn't... Like, the, the, the Pegasus Knights are very accurate, and they have killer lances. They might still hit her. And Dawn, while she is dodgy, she's not super tanky, actually. Alright, I will Physic Tendaris. Oh, shit. They might... The rogues. No, wait. Dawn is super fast. They won't steal her stuff. No, 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 no. Uh, they won't, they won't, they're not fast enough to steal from her, it's absolutely fine. Alright, so what I can do here is I can kill the two of them, and then hope that Tendaris deals with Gabriel. And, uh, probably just put John over here. I'm a little bit worried, though, because this rogue is probably gonna steal Cyrus's... Oh, he's gonna steal Cyrus's holy symbol, oh no. That's terrible. I need to get that back. Oh shit. Oh no. He's gonna steal Cyrus' holy symbol. Actually, he might steal the Pyrion shield. Uh, John is not dead. We can just get him out of there. John is a staff bot. That's all he's here for. Rescue Cyrus. That would actually have been a good play. What the fuck? Assuming you want Rip Holy Symbol? Uh, maybe. 
wrong position for for John. He's out of range of the master uh, master bow. That's all that matters. Does enemy have AI priority on green units? No, but green units are often weak, so enemies will sometimes go for them. Yeah, nope, not risking that. Um, I'm not. I don't really want to risk that either. Where's Helga's Pyrion shield? It's it's right there. Okay, this is a kill. At least I can proc Gale Force off this. That's all I really want to do. Is there anything more accurate for Helga? I could have given her Elwind, I guess. But I didn't. Battle preparations fail. Right, we don't really have anything to do with Aisha. I guess just prepare. We, honestly, I think running up here with Aisha. Uh, we need help over here. And we don't know where the assassins will spawn. Alright, here we go. Poor Scotty. Poor. <laughs> Poor Scotty. Ah, Lightbringer Chan, no. Lightbringer Chan, no. Crit? Ah. Beam me up, Scotty. <laughs> that's a good one. Beam me up, Scotty. Wow, that's that's clever. Wow, what a what thanks, Helga. I really appreciate these reinforcements, I gotta say. Yeah. Dawn will easily deal with this group. Because they're all magic damage, and Dawn eats magic damage for breakfast. Yeah, and they're using their this is this I set it up so that they would use the ice lance against Dawn and not the killer lance. Because again, she eats magic for breakfasts. Mangs, my dono. Mangs, to think we will ever go back to be recruitable enemies instead of every character just joining your party. What? Mangs, to think we will ever go back to recruitable enemies instead of every character just Yeah, right? Did we recruit a single enemy and engage? I mean, I know Movier joins you, but he doesn't... He's not recruited from the red side. I miss that. I miss that. I just like fighting on the front, but I suppose I have no choice. If you would just be so kind as to lie down here and die for me, that would be appreciated. Oh, he has bow range plus one. He has bow range plus one. And he's in a forest, so we can't kill him anymore. Oh, Linden, right. Oh, we're Linden, you're right. How could I forget about this not forgettable character, Linden? I mean, who could forget about Linden? I mean, he's so memorable. What a... What a memorable character. Linden, of course. My favorite character in all of Engage. Try surrounding him? Yeah, that's probably what I'm gonna have to do. Linden of the Lindus Wolves. Let's go. Whew. Yeah, I could. I'm definitely gonna try and surround Gabriel. I think that's probably the play, because he can't attack at front. Or he can't attack up close, unlike his brother. Yeah, I've heard Lyndon can get a lot of crit, that's pretty much about it. But can't every character in Engage get like a thousand crit if you know the right builds? Alright, Aubrey's gonna join now? Or is she just gonna show up? Okay, thank goodness, I thought... I thought they were gonna steal her shit. I was like, oh my goodness. Very nice, absolute dawn win right here. Violin of the Coyotes men have a better start. Do you guys know that there's a hack called Violin Emblem? 
Oh my goodness, why did you not... Why did you not steal? What? Huh? Why do you not steal? Huh? I don't get it. Why did you not- I don't get it. Okay. Alright, here comes the- here comes the bishops. Let's go, Theo. Let's go, Theo. Honestly, maybe he should have gotten the Eternal Sail. Duh. No steel patch, that's right. I forgot I applied that. Can you hit anything, Theo? Come on. Oh, he's got a rank. Maybe we'll get that Rose Thorn anyway. Let's go, Theo. Clop, 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 clop. Alright, there's Moriana. No Archkale, though. What the fuck? This guy's still alive? Nice 18 strength Rose Thorn. Hey man, you don't need strength to wield the Rose Thorn. Alright, here we go. Well, well, looks like the battle is finally starting to heat up. I suppose this is a good time for me to get involved. I was paid handsomely to take out the enemy general. No man survives once I get a contract on his head. Oh boy. Oh boy, shit, Brandon. Ooh. We got some friends coming in here. Caroline will sweep this though, it's fine. Oh. Alright, we gotta find her. We gotta find her. We gotta find her. Uh, where is she? Aubrey, mommy, where are you? That was one mommy. But she's not particularly scary. She doesn't have the arch gal. Uh, let's see, where is she? Oh, there she is. And she's actually pretty close to Jaka. I think I can actually. Can I reach her this turn? Uh, where is she? Wait, what? She's in this forest tile. Uh. I think, uh, can I reach her? If you dance? Well, um... No, I can't actually. I'll need to rescue. If I run up to Jaka, tank the... You might need to rescue with Lilith. Yeah, I think I need to. I need to do that. You're right. Oof, this 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 freaking commander right here is very scary. Not against Caroline, but against everyone else on my team. Um, and I need to send someone to to rescue Brandon. I guess Aisha would work for that. All right, let's do Dicer on this guy. Oh, Dicer, Dicer, my beloved. So I have a rescue in the convoy. I can grab it and teleport Jaka two spaces up. That might actually make him reach Aubrey, which would be very nice. Oh, actually, what I can do is I can... I don't even need to do that. I can kill, dance. I can kill, rescue, drop, drop, dance. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... Yeah, she's here. I mean, I guess Aubrey can just have fun attacking Ahmed for a turn, right? Claymore not give 10 speed? It should. Oh, there we go. Oh, yeah, beautiful. Let's use it. Look at this beautiful sword right here. Oh, shit. What is Caroline's luck? What is Caroline's luck? Okay. Uh, this is a devil sword. So, if she has 21 luck, she's fine. Okay, she has 40 luck. This, this is fine. Oh, we do have these guys, though. Um, you know what? I think... I think Aubrey will be okay. I'll just pull her with Ahmed.
It's okay, we don't need to recruit Aubrey this turn. She comes running towards us. She has an AI to seek out Jaka. She ha literally has an AI to seek out Jaka. Let's go, Ahmed. Oh shit, no, it's the divine! <laughs> Oh no! <laughs> he meets the one item that's dangerous to him. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, that's that's actually really funny. I'm not gonna lie, that that's that is fucking hilarious. All right, we need to heal up Little Nat. Um, sorry, Thundertone. And give this girl an elixir. <laughs> oh yeah, you can arena with Ahmed. Oh yeah, you can totally arena with Ahmed. It's super funny, actually. Now he crits. Do you still have 50k? Oh, uh, good question. Do I? I think so? Oh, Cyrus, please crit. Oh, thank you. Huh? Oh, you did? Which one? Oh, you got all the red dust. It's, it's pretty shitty, but it's funny. <laughs> oh, John. I think John just needs to get the fuck out. What do you have? Albert and a heavy spare. Wow, John is so useful in this battle. Well, at least he can physic Tandaris. That's not terrible, right? You had 53k before the arena, you're fine. I hope so. It would be kind of funny if I talked to Aubrey and it's like, you don't have the cash. Serum has donated two bucks. I'm gonna be like, I'm die, thank you forever. <laughs> So, I think she just murders this entire group, right? What do they have? They have- they only have wind swords. And the brave sword does worry me a little bit, but I can just kill- Oh wow, she doesn't- um, hmm. None of the magic should be able to really do damage to her, so... I'm just gonna hold this bridge, and she'll be fine. Was Aubrey inspired by Renek and Jafar? No, she was actually inspired by Heather, except that she's not cringe. Oh, I completely forgot about this guy. Uh, I'm not gonna hit him. Yeah, I'm not gonna hit him. I am not going to hit this guy. Who else can this guy- oh god. Uh, yeah, you need to get- get out. Can Aubrey attack anyone else? Um, Jaka has a holy symbol, right? Um, she won't kill Caroline. She moves towards Jaka, right? Simply bait her into attacking. She prioritizes Jaka, yeah. Just pull with Ahmed. She'll kill the green unit, that's what she does. She'll kill the green unit. Yeah, I'm not risking a lethality with Jaka, just that's not happening. I am definitely not messing around with that. Alright, what about the Ubunga Bali against, uh... Oh boy, he can retaliate, oh shit. Why did you go to the arena? I like the way the, the people move. Aubrey has lethality, yes she does. Aubrey doesn't fuck around, and she gets 10% extra lethality from her dagger, so... You really don't want to fuck around with her. I feel like we probably need some help over here. You know what, it's a good thing Ahmed died, because now I can summon him again. Yeah, I think we need some help over here, honestly. Oh, look at that! A 
It's Spot for Helga. And uh, what does she have? Does she have anything anti-flyer? I should have given her an Elwyn. I really want to keep her next attendees. I'll put Varg here. Anyone to heal? Darius? You know what? You go for it, Varg. You can't let Gabriel target the Lightbringer. If anything, that'll get him out of the war forest, so... Forest, really? Keep in mind the Gale Shot gives Gil. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. It does, doesn't it? Uh-oh. Gale Force. Uh... Oh, shit. Damn, look at this. Look at this regalia right here. Zero, six, zero. Let's go. Oh my goodness, what a unit. She's stronger than Dawn now? I think she is. Two percent chance to backfire? No, because she has plus ten luck. So she... She has 0% chance to backfire with the Claymore. Yeah, Carolina's officially the best unit on my team, and it's not even close. With the Claymore, she's unstoppable. Ah! Oh ho ho ho! These guys have heavy spares! What the hell? Oh no! Thank goodness for Pavice. Oh, blank level up on Cyrus. Great. Perfect. No, don't shoot Brandon! Oh shit, Brandon is in danger. Oh shit, Brandon is in danger. Oh no! Brandon, no! Oh no! Oh no, Brandon is in danger! Brandon is in danger! Oh no. Oh no. Let's go, Brandon. <laughs> I'm in danger. Oh no, let's go, Brandon, please. Alright. I will honor the memory of Lord Wester Winlands. I will carry out his last wish to the best of my ability. Ow! Ow! Fucking glaciers! And here comes the Horfrosts. Ay 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 ay! I forgot how scary glaciers can be. They insist on attacking me with the Wind Swords, though, instead of the Brave Swords. I guess that's good. Oh, wow, they double me now thanks to Horfrost. That's hilarious. Da da da. But they deal zero damage with the Wind Swords. That should be fine. Wow, I don't double anymore. That's sad. Okay, she ignores the units. Okay. Oh no, don't crit. Don't crit. Please don't crit. Please don't crit. Please don't crit. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Lightbringer Chan. Oh boy, here comes the Pegasus Knights. And what's next? Is the Alistor coming? Oh no, that, that bishop is dead. Oh yeah, she's 100% dead. She's still, he's still in the forests. Get him, Theo. Get him. Go get the Alastor, Theo. Hit points, magic, skill, defense, and resistance on Theo. Nice. Am I unbanned now? You were never, un you were never banned. Hey. Hey. Damn recover staves. Oh my goodness. 
Brandon, drink your elixir. Drink your- drink your adrenochrome, Brandon! Ah, hey, hey. Look at that, Lightbringer Chon helps me- helps me surround him. Oh, he's still in a forest. Why do I see saying what? How are you not drinking elixirs right now, dude? Wait, can I save Brandon? Is that possible? Well, that was scary. Um, that was really scary. I don't like that Glacius at all. Oh boy, I'm gonna have to put Almond in front here. Uh, Brandon is in danger, you guys. Yeah, I gotta save him. Okay, so we know that uh, Atalanta comes in from this side, so we'll keep her here, I think. I'll kill her immediately with Caroline, and then transfer the, uh... Transfer the, uh, the, uh... The Alastor to Theo. Kill Brandon with John? Yeah, I will do that. How scary are these guys against- oh my goodness. Okay, we have a Doolum, or actually just an Oogumboomba Bali. Uh, I think I need to rescue someone? I think- I think I need to rescue Aisha. Yeah, I need to rescue Aisha and put her in front of Brandon. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that's what I need to do. We need to get Ahmed out of here. Or we need to put Ahmed in a wood or something so the ships... So these guys will go for him. And then we need to use John to rescue Aisha. So she can save her... Yeah, I'll heal Brandon. I'll heal Brandon. Don't worry about it. Well, the ships... Brandon has a uh, goddess icon, I think. Or like a holy symbol on him, I think. Oh, no, he doesn't, actually. Did they have crit on him? Did the ships have crit on him? They better not have crit on him. Let's heal Brandon. Oh, I'll, I'll recruit Aubrey this turn. Where is she? There she is. Hey, you! You're Aubrey. You run the Thieves' Guild. You notice me snaking up on you? Ha! <laughs> not bad. But even if you notice me, it won't matter. A minute from now, you'll join your friend Baudimon. I take it Mortimer has paid you a good sum of gold to take me out. I'm guessing he also paid you to abduct my family, am I right? It's nothing personnel, kid. Just another contract. And what if I were to match this offer? Would you be willing to switch sides? Maybe convince the thief skills to get off our backs while we fight? My loyalties are always flexible, but if you want me to betray the King of Andoran, well, that's going to be quite a tidy sub. Name your price, assassin, and I'll give you the answer. Mortimer promised me 30,000 gold to assassinate the Lord of Lances. Has he paid you yet? If not, and if I kill him, then... No, his majesty hasn't paid me yet, and he won't lie, it does annoy me. If you do kill me, he might treat you as a loose end. You won't get a single coin, only a spare in your gut. And if I kill him, you won't get paid for your services. You'll simply have to make an enemy of me. I'm listening. I'll match his price, 30,000 gold, and I'll pay right now. Get your guild to turn, the ki turn on the king and we'll go home alive. Not good enough. If you screw up, I'm definitely dying to the little king. The price is 50,000 if you want me to help take down King Mortimer. For that sum, I'll order the rest of the guild to stop sending more goons. Though I'm not sure if I can stop the assassins already engaged in battle. 50,000 gold, you drive a hard bargain. Let's go. Alright, here's the money. You better be worth it. Oh, trust me, little darling. I'm worth every gold piece. Can you order the thief skill to stop attacking us as well? I cannot have stopped the assassins who are already out in the streets. However, I will relay orders to the guild to stop sending more. That's good enough for me. Alright! Here she is, Aubrey. 50,000 gold! The price is 50. 50,000. And the gun is yours. Um, here we got Aubrey. She's really good. Insane growth rates. It, I mean, it doesn't really matter. I guess if you give her an eternal sale, she can cap strength, which is nice. Um, 120% defense. She's pretty insane. She's got lethality, deadly strikes, shade, and luck touch. So, a uh, very, very strong unit. S rank in swords, comes with the Pesh Gods. <coughs> and knows how to use it. Look at that crit rate. Look at that crit rate she's got going on there. Oh, 
There we go. Yeah, if you talk to her with Coulter, she's 30k. Alright, so now we got some Pegasus Knights, and they got Brave Lances. I don't think Lilinette and Theodore can deal with that if I'm gonna be comp Even Dawn is getting kinda hard-pressed here because of that fucking Glacies, and I'm worried if this, this Swordmaster uses her Brave Sword, that could get very nasty very quick, so... But, first things first, we gotta heal Brandon. The ships has crit rate on Brandon? No fucking way. I refuse to believe that. They have 8 crit, and he has 30 luck. Liar! You are a liar! You are a liar! How does it feel to be exposed on stream as a liar? That's right, you are a liar! Liar, liar. Uh. Mangs, did you heal Brandon? I did, I did, I did. Ships have Brandon Slayers? Oh, that would be so PH to give them a Brandon Slayer effective against Brandon. Ruins precedencies. I think we can do an Ubumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbumbum
Uh, God damn it. Huh? Tumbo? What did, what did Tumbo say? Mr. T donated 49 to Super Chat. 499 to Super Chat. Hell yeah, I believe in LGBT. Let's go, Brandon and Trump. <laughs> Not funny. Alright, um. So here's the thing, even if Gabriel kills this guy, it's not really gonna make him Kanto anywhere, but I also think ten Chicken Tendis is kinda screwed if he sticks around. So I think what we're gonna do is, I have no idea. I I'm guessing keeping Helga, like, no, but he even kills here, doesn't he? No, actually, if, t if Chicken Tendis moves in like this, Oh, wait, but wait, 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 we have fucking Ice Lances. Oh, boy. Yeah, three Ice Lances. Run! Chicken Tendies, you are gonna die. Yeah, fuck it. No. I'm Gale Forcing the hell out of here. That is, that is not happening. In fact, maybe Tendaris can... Oh, yes, he kills the Assassin. Yeah, I'm running. I'm running away from here. This is not... Yeah, sorry. Why is Gabriel so goddamn dodgy? Because he's on a forest with the Gale shot, that's why. Let's go, Kanto! Hit points, magic, speed, luck, and two resistance on Tendis. That's nice. Is that his final level? Not quite yet. And then we just, we got, we gotta just like... Is there any way we can kill here? Is there, okay, we can Kanto on the Sage actually with Helga. Sorry, we can Gale Force with the Sage on Helga, I mean. Although it's definitely not guaranteed. That is, though. How are you going to kill Gabriel? That's the problem for next turn, Manx. Anyoing. Oh my god, everywhere can be attacked! But I guess it's I guess it's mainly like um, it's mainly ballista boats, so it's not really a big deal. All right, they're going. I, okay, I'm, I'm gonna get a Pepsi. I'm getting a Pepsi. Brandon has 22 HP left. Oh, this is giving me anxiety. Brave sword, oh no. You see, it can hit me though. Kill the Glacious Woman right now, she's gonna get healed. She's 100% going to get healed. Oh! Hellblazer, let's go. The Great Lords donated five rubles to Super Chat. Told you how many told you how many units can I put in a map? Also for every boss there is leadership stars. If you don't kill enough, they snowball. Yeah, I'm well aware. I'm well aware. Alright, he's gonna he's gonna canto. He's gonna get uh Gale Force. He's gonna he's gonna canto! <laughs> Spare Garden, Garden of Spares. I know, right? Super original. Alright. And this is why we barrier Jaka. He's not... Unless he crits, he's not doubling this guy, is he? Oh, never mind, he is! 
I guess the Iceland sways him down slightly because these commanders have capped speed. He's going to Kanto! Blank level up for Jaka. Glad I gave him that eternal seal. Kanto is for noobs. Let's go. Oh boy. He's countering! Mmm. Lovely. This 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 woman will never die. This woman will never die. Okay, I, I don't think he's on I don't think he's on a forest anymore. I think he's on a house. So to make it a little bit more... I can't get let Gabriel come close to Brandon, though. That would be terrible. Reinforcements from Tim has arrived. No, that's just more enemies for Gabriel to count to Gale Force off. Oh, no. That's just more enemies. Okay, please kill the boats. Please kill the boats. No, kill the boats. Kill the boats, please! Oh no, they're on the houses. Oh wow. What a, what, what great Vyvern Lords. Good. Alright, here we go, there she is. This is the chance for House Rose to redeem and set itself in the eyes of the king. Everyone push forward, show them that we are still a house to be feared. Okay, 8 out of 12. Next turn, I believe, is... Next turn is another wave, and then it's Alexander on turn 10, Brianna turn 12. We might do this, ladies and gentlemen. So there is Ag Adalena with the Alastor. 156 hit. Um, I don't think she's that scary to Car... The thing is, Caroline doesn't really do a whole lot to her either. Actually, yeah, look at that, 5 damage. Not bad. Honestly, if we put if we put Caroline here, they all have horse slayers, but I don't think they do that much to her, do they? Uh, they have yeah, all of them have horse slayers, but I don't think they'll hit her. So she one rounds, she does. Oh my god, she does. That's a kill, isn't it? But miracle, miracle, miracle. Yeah, no. I think we'll stay in the woods. We'll stay in the woods. We are staying in the woods, ladies and gentlemen. We are not leaving the woods. All right, this girl needs to die. Uh, this girl needs to die like yesterday. Okay, I think we got Brandon secure. We can use the Brave Axe to kill this guy now. Bro, she would have been below 50%. It was a one round. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you're probably right. Nothing we can do about that now. Alright, let's go. Oh, we gotta kill this girl. Crit, maybe? Okay, no glaciers, no glaciers. Crit, 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 no, okay. Well, actually, Helga might be able to kill here. I think Helga, if she can get a weapon triangle or something. Oh, look at that, uh, Dula. Yeah, look at that, beautiful. Hmm. Dawn bad, sack better. Lord Wester, forgive me. Is finally goner. Oh, thank you for the Horfrost. I okay. I thought I thought I thought it didn't proc for some reason. I was like, what? Okay. I th okay. We got a bunch of guys coming in here. Uh, I think Jaka can probably. Okay. What do we have here? We have Brave Lances, Dire Thunder. Yeah, no. 
No. Uh, but we need to kill this guy. This guy needs to die. 52 hits? Oh my god, what am I gonna do with the squad right here? I'm just gonna die. What am I gonna do with the squad? Okay, I guess I'm gonna have to trick him into attacking Dawn. It's like the... But he attacks from 3 range, so... How the hell am I supposed to... How am I supposed to kill this guy? I need to surround him, but the, the chicken tenders will die to this. Chicken tenders will die to this. Like, 100% he will die to this. Send on into the arena. Yeah, that'll help. Let the Southeastern group run at you one more turn and get your units ready for them. Yeah, I think that's probably what I'm gonna have to do. I'm just gonna have to, like, send Tendaris onto this gate, drink an elixir. Just try to get out of range, because the Ice Lances will murder Tendaris. They will, they will absolutely murder him. And, ironically, I guess Brave Lance is what we want here? Yeah, let's go for it. Season 7 is coming. Oh, fuck no. No, 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 no. Okay, I'm keeping sorry the hell away. These guys are actually kind of scary. I'm not a big fan of them. I think we'll send Jocko over here. Okay, can he reach? It doesn't matter if he can reach. I'll... Can this guy kill Sari? Okay, wait, she has Shade. Well, they'll still go for her, though. Uh... Aubrey has 95 avoid. This guy has 145 hit, so... The Dire Thunder can actually murder him. I'll put Almond here. We need to get Aisha in on, in, in on the action as well. Make it get Theo in range of Dawn for the reduced damage on her. I don't think that's gonna really matter. I kinda wanna do this. Oh, never mind. That's not a kill. What the hell? Yeah, never mind. That's not a kill. That is not a kill. I think this guy doubles Zari. Yeah, 30 speed. That is terrifying. Why didn't I just kill him with Jaka and a Brave Lance? That was absolutely stupid. I mean, yeah, I, I guess the best thing I can do in this situation is just to put Aubrey here with the Peshkats. Or, maybe even better, like put Aubrey here. Is Ahmed in Gabriel range? He might very well be. He might very well be. At this point, I don't know if there's much we can do about it. What did Theo do for Aubrey to get the Peshkots anyway? Maybe she stole it from her? You never know. Yeah, I'm gonna have to get Aubrey... I'll go dance for Aubrey, I think. Or I'll send Aubrey over here. And then maybe I can... Okay, so let's see here. I mean, who is he gonna Gale Force on, though? There's no green units in range, so I think we're fine here, actually. Lily Gale shot her to death? Who's gonna kill Lily Nat? Oh, nice. 25 speed on, on the sorry. Let's go. Well, well, well. Let's go, Theo. Come on, come on, come on, Theo. Let's go. Gale Force? You mean Kanto? I love how Theo is basically just riding in circles. <laughs> Have you noticed that? Theo is just riding in circles. It's kind of funny. Evasive maneuvers. Yeah, it's nice. It's it's very nice actually. Diet warrior spin. <laughs> Gale Force is Kanto Plus, exactly. Okay. Put Varg on the fort. 
Let's heal up Dawn, just to be sure. I know I'm not very worried about her, but still, I want everyone on full health. Get Ragnarok for Helga, yes. Oh, I don't know why I didn't get it already. No, but I, at least the boats are going for the Vibrance now. Man, Starfall gives Miracle, the other one gives Vantage. Oh, but Adelena has Miracle. She has Miracle as a personal skill, I'm fairly certain. Well, great regalia. And now she'll die. And Theo can finally get his regalia. Her personal is inside? Oh, really? Oh, sorry, I didn't read her dialogue. My bad. Terribly sorry. Can you rescue the boat? I think so? Man, look at that house rose sage, Paulette. That's a rare one. That's almost never seen. La na na na. Imagine reading. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Adelana has miracle. Yeah, I'm pretty sure she has miracle. Mangs, how do you not recognize the palettes? What colorblind are you? What? What? I recognize the palettes. I can see that they exist. I don't see the world in black and white. Oh, oh, okay. Uh, okay. Caroline Mortal. These halberdiers actually kind of scary. What the hell? Okay, alright. Man sees the world in blonde and brunette. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, the horse slayers are scary, but not scary enough. They were able to damage Caroline, though. Which is kind of rare. Alright, he's coming closer! Oh, we need to kill this guy! <laughs> Car Caroline with the claymore deserves a custom hit animation. I agree. But, um, we didn't have enough- we didn't have more space for the ROM, so... Alright, um, Alexander's gonna show up next turn with 10 leadership stars. That's not gonna be fun at all. That is not going to be fun at all. Aw oh, shit, Gabriel's gonna get 10 extra void. Oh no. Uh oh. Yeah. Oh! Aegis, let's go! <laughs> Aegis, let's go! <laughs> oh, that's great. Let's go! Alright, this is this is when shit's gonna get really hard. This is where Alexander actually does she show up this turn or next? Oh wow, thanks a lot, Timmy. Oh. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I mean, thanks a lot! <laughs> wow. Damn. Damn, okay, I appreciate that. Okay, there's no reinforcements this turn, thank goodness. We have another turn before Alexander shows up. Oh, that's, that's, that's a relief. My goodness, that's a relief. And most of the Pegasus Knights are flying up here now, which is very good. Okay, so we need to get Ahmed over here. I wish I had dark spikes on Darius, but this will have to do. 69 hit. Let's go! Oh, let's go! Huge. Cyrus distracting the Pegness was great. Yeah, now I can trap Gabriel. I know, right? Oh, that's so good. That is so good. I really needed that. Okay, 
Okay, how scary are these guys against Cyrus? Not very, I think, but I'm a little worried about the aura guy. If I could get a crit on this guy, that would be huge. I'ma try it. I'm gonna try it. I'm gonna try it. Come on, Cyrus. Yes! No! What? It's not a kill? Oh no, I manged math! Is he in range of Darius or in or Brandon? No, he's not. Okay, that's good. Uh, Helga, you need to get over here. ASAP. Dark spikes the sky, please. Gabriel was the chosen one. How could this happen? Oh, go get him, Helga. Go get him. Yeah! Fuck you, Gabriel. Seems like I miscalculated. All it takes is one slip-up. No deaths yet. Woo! Okay. Um, I guess it's Brave Land's time. I feel confident. Let's send Dawn into the arena. 980 for Dawn. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Oh, wow. I think I can beat him. I think I can beat him. Oh, she doubles him. This is uh, this is fine. Oof. Uh, she wins. She wins. Ooh. Does she have the... Yeah, she has the holy symbol, right? Yeah, okay. Easy. Still, though, gladiators are pretty insane. Alright, so there's a Dire Thunder guy over there. I really don't want to fuck with him. Uh, does Caroline have healing? Yes, she does. Okay, good. I'll uh, heal her up. Yeah, gladiators are super rare enemies that can show up in the arena, but Dawn was just too bonkers. Do you get a playable gladiator in Almanon Saga? Yes! He's a 1 in 50 chance. You get Crixus in Chapter 13. He's a gladiator. And now... I think I shall go and get Theo's rightful... Tome for Alexander. Healing the green unit? Of course! We gotta keep the green units alive. They've proven to be very useful. Yes, Theo, finally. Finally. This. This is the Theo. This is the Theo I've been waiting for. Oh, shit. Wait, he's in... Oh, God. Is he going to be okay? I, I think he's going to be fine. I mean, that's Alastor. He'll be okay, right? Ralphner cannot promote the gladiator? No. All right, I will wait here for Alexander. It's fine, it gives vantage. Yeah, it's really good. Alosteo and Rosteo. He can dual wield Regalia. He's, I think he's the only playable character you have that can dual wield. No, actually, Dawn. Dawn can dual wield Regalia. All right, we're ready for Alexander, you guys. We're ready for him. We are ready for Alexander to show up. Da 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 da. Oh, Christina. Yeah, Christina can do it. Okay, I think Ahmed is getting double here. Yes, he is. Poor Ahmed. Mortimer can wield seven regalias. Yeah, I guess he can. That's actually a good point.
La la la. How many Ahmeds have died this run? Quite a few. What does Starfall even hail from? If you train a High Mortimer, can he use Starfall? Yes, he can. Oh, let's go, Alastor! Come on, Theo, get crit, get crit, get crit, get crit. No, get crit, get crit! Wait, is he gonna get doubled now? Because Alastor is heavy. Ah! Shit. Oh, here comes the oh, here comes the aura. Here comes the aura. But Tima Chan still lives. Ah, oh, Timea Chan. Timea Chan, you did so well. Alastor's Montage disables crit? Is this intentional? What? It shouldn't. I don't think it does, Hanako. I think you're wrong. I think you're wrong, Hanako. I don't remember adding that. It does? Really? Vantage never lets you crit. Yeah, I think that might be intentional. Okay, here we go. Hmm, the other houses have not defeated the enemy yet. So, ah, uh, fine. I'll do it myself. Alright, there he is, Alexander. We got a bunch of spares. I'd say we let Jaka deal with them first. Do we have a regular spare? But we are ready for him. Let's go, Aubrey. Proc your lethality. I believe you can do it. There you go. Caroline should kill Alexander. She's too far away, though. Hit points, strength, defense, and resistance. I don't- I would be surprised if Caroline is able to reach him. Alright, let's go, Theo. You can do it. Get a crit, maybe? No? What the hell? Oh, you can rescue her. Yeah, this is true. There you go. I wonder if Mengs can kill Brianna? Uh, I probably need to deal with all the Harbringers first. I don't think I ha I mean... I don't know, maybe like... I mean, she has like 40 defense. There, it is definitely possible to kill her. I'll, I'll see if it's possible, but I don't think it is. Alright, I'll give Jocka a fiery chance. Manx, watch out for Kanto! <laughs> Alcacer donated two bucks. Why do spare garden calves look like Violin? Because we like Violin of the Coyotes men. Why wouldn't we? Oh boy. Let's go, Helga. I don't think you can. The only time I managed to do it was getting a Glacius. But yeah, she has like 43 defense. So it's almost impossible, but it is. I mean, I know, I know people can do it. Like Void Flare can do it, for example. Honestly, we, if we do a double Void Flare on her, if we do a double Void Flare on her, I think we can do it actually. If we do a uh, Helga Varg, so how how highly do you rate Cyrus now? I think he's very good. Uh, he's only- he's very good with the Hellblazer. If, he, if he's your only Hellblazer user, I feel like he uses the Hellblazer really well. And he's not that hard to get, honestly. The 
The five leadership stars is insanely nice, too. This is true. This is very true. The five leadership stars are insanely good. Alright, we're ready for Alexander's squad. We gotta kill him before Brianna's Harbinger show up. But we're doing pretty well. We're doing really well. Oh shit, wait. This Sorry needs to get the fuck out of here. Oh yeah, she does. I'm gonna put Varg behind Jaka. With an Osferatu. Anyone need healing? Let's heal to Chan. why not? This can be extremely dangerous. Yeah, Alexander's a boss. He's definitely like the strongest boss in the game at this point. Alright, let's get... We can even put... Let's put Tendaris next to him as well for the added. <laughs> why not? Let's have some fun. Oh shit, Aisha cannot... Wait, can I drop here? Okay, cool. I can. Nice. We got the supports lined up. It's fine. So if you... The thing about Alexander is if you don't kill enough units until he shows up, he'll buff the entire field with 10 leadership stars and make everything just hell for you. What?! Oh shit, I didn't realize he was in range! A ragtime band of filthy rebels. That's all you'll ever be. You're worth less than the dirt beneath my boots. Try not to ruin my lands in the process of impaling yourself. It's okay, he's fine. He's got a holy symbol. He'll get doubled, though, for sure. Okay, good. Yeah, yeah I put a holy symbol on Tundaris. Thank goodness for that. Ooh, that crit rate on Varg is not fun. Ooh, that crit rate on Varg is not fun. <laughs> That's fun. Ba -ba. La 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 Abop. Oof. Yeah, Alexander hits hard. Shade. Yeah, Shade is, uh, Shade is really working, you guys. Looks like if things are going to get rough, I suppose I will lend a hand as well. I can only use this artifact a single time, however, I think that time has come. Voidwalkers, I call upon your strength. There they are. Oh no, the PH, you forgot to update their warp animations. That's funny. Their warps are misaligned. Luna Bros, let's go! Final, final ROM, let's go! Final, final ROM! Alright, we have to kill Alexander right now. I believe we can do it. Start off with Dawn. Jocko will get the honors. Oh shit, Caroline is all the way up there, though. Maybe the time has come to try and rescue Caroline down here. What's my, uh... I think if I run with Caroline, like so, and then I rescue her with John... Oh, we're gonna kill him with Caroline. That'll be super fun. Why doesn't Crixus have any supports? Oh yeah, she's in range. Oh, she's in range. Let's go. Oh wait, she's not in range. Shit. Uh, Varg, get over here. Get over here. There we go! Is she in range now? Yes! <laughs> oh, we need to set up the throne. We need to set up the throne for her. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, she's gonna fucking murder him. She's gonna murder him. Let's go. Alex, keep your mouth shut, woman. I don't speak to traitors. 
you killed him, didn't you? You're not exactly narrowing it down. My husband, your brother, you murdered Armand. Oh, that stuttering fool, I did not kill him, Caroline. I simply didn't rescue him. In the end, his death served to benefit me quite a bit. Stealing his wife was just a cherry on top of it all. My older brother always did have so much more than me. But look at me now, I'm the lord of House Spiragarden, while Armand rots in the dirt and nobody remembers him. I had the last laugh. You're wrong, I remember him. You were hailed as Andalon's breast and bravest general, but you're just a monster masquerading as a person. You played me like a fiddle. I believe all of your lies. I believe all of your lies. You were practically begging me to manipulate you. It was so easy I grew bored. Ready your lance. You're going to fight me? Ready your lance. I won't say it again. You're idiots. You'll soon learn what it means to fight me. <laughs> Bonk! <laughs> All men die eventually, but my legend will live on. <laughs> Fucking murdered! <laughs> Wow! Fucking murdered! He didn't ready his land. <laughs> no one will remember that. Oh my goodness. That wasn't a fight. That was an execution. Dun, 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 Plop, 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 plop. Get Alistair, get Alistair, get Alistair, get Alistair, get Alistair, get Alistair. How does Manx do so well? I play better under pressure, that's why. Now I'm actually using my brain. Also, I got a very good team. Like, I, like I've lost a lot of units, but the units that I have left are very strong. I have... Caroline with the Claymore was absolutely huge. The fact that I got that event was insanely good. So we got some guys coming in here. I don't think they'll be a problem though. I think I'll send I'll send everything at Brianna right now. I think that is the play. I think if I double Void Flare her, I think I can kill her. This is a deathless stream so far, yeah, it is. Mengs when he's not gambling away the run on stupid plays. I mean, this chapter is a snowball chapter. If you're able to do well in the mid-game and, like, kill the enemies as they come, this chapter is manageable, but it, it, it can also, like, snowball very fast up on you. If you don't kill enemies fast enough, you'll be overwhelmed. You're not gonna keep anyone back for Bandon? I don't need to. It's fine. Stop it. Get some help. They're not gonna reach Bandon, we'll be fine. They should make an anime out of this game. Oh, let's go! Luna Voidwalker, let's go! Actually... Oh, I could use him- Oh, now I get why you guys want me to keep this guy alive, because he can- Because he can kill Brianna. Oh! Oh! Now I get it! You need to kill all the bosses, all the named bosses on this map. So once you kill, Ka once you kill uh, Brianna, uh oh, I'm sorry, Mortimer. I won't be there for you in the end. Forgive me. You'll have to complete our work alone. Soldiers of Flame Guard, we shall fight for Andron. Show no mercy. Cut down the Jacka Corpse at all costs. Wait, aren't those the creatures we fought in Alvaro's dungeon? I thought we killed them all. How many? How can there be so many more? Everyone, be careful. Don't let those monsters overwhelm you. Chapter 1, one turn after every boss has been defeated. Alright. Mortimer prefers women. Okay, so we got... Dire Thunder, Nosferatu, Dire Thunder, Volganon, Volganon. Oof. Yeah, we'll definitely let them... Uh, I mean, Dawn probably murders these guys. But Brianna is very scary. She does 70 damage. And she'll have Weapon Triangle and Dawn as well, so... I say, we back off. What do we have here? We should, you know what? I agree. We should rescue that, that Luna Voidwalker. 
We absolutely should. Oh, you gotta kill Briad on this map. Yeah, you do. Hey, get ba get get back here. Get back here. Let's barrier up Varg. I think Varg can also kill kill Brianna with the Void Flyer, especially if he gets a Fiery Chan. Yeah, well, we're, we're Fiery Chanting up Varg here. Manx, is it FE7 Luna? No, 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 no. Absolutely not. Alright, so Helga, where's Helga? Yeah, we... This, yeah, I'm not, I'm not fucking with that. I think we're just gonna back off a little bit, let them come closer to us. My Emilia killed a weak in Brianna. Yeah, Emilia with the Void Flare can probably deal with her. I agree. How guys still all the way up? Oh yeah, there she is. All right, I'll send uh, Cyrus back to uh, back to protect Brandon just in case. Alright, so Brianna can attack here, so we'll do... We'll, we'll put Dawn right here. Let's heal up the Voidwalker as well, he took a little bit of damage. Make sure your unit with a lot of rest fights Brianna. Uh, yeah, because Brianna can pop... Brianna can proc Ignis, which adds a lot. Yeah, that that can hit really hard. But it's okay. I got her. Oh boy, here comes the Flame Guard squad. That guy's probably dead, isn't he? You can one shot her with an Ariel Ash Cleaver crit. Yeah, I mean she only has like 45 defense. It's not unkillable. Oh no, this guy is a Fenrir tome. Yes, Hanako, you don't need to repeat yourself, I see it. Mm -hmm. Manx is merely pretending to be ignorant. I'm, I'm just pretending to be bad at fire emblem, you guys. Hanako, someone time Hanako out. Can I time out my mods? I I'm gonna check right now, Hanako. Can I, can I time out Hanako? I can. There you go, Hanako. You just got timed out. I timed out my mod for 300 seconds. <gasps> oh shit. That's right, Hanako. Try speaking now, Hanako. Huh? Try speaking now, Hanako. That's right. <laughs> Does that remove mod status? I don't think so. Yeah, no spamming allowed, guys. No spamming allowed. It more curse of misogyny. <laughs> curse of misogyny. That's funny. Ah oh, yeah, Luna, Luna Voidwalker, let's go! Bom bom ba da bom. Timachan wants revenge. Okay. Oh, they all oh okay, I see. I see. Okay, so I'll, I'll kill this guy with Dom. And then I'll rescue her back. Why would Manx time me out? I'm not a woman. Ah, uh, if you spam, PH. If you spam. Brianna does phys physical damage. Oh! Oh! Oh, she does, doesn't she? Oh! 
Oh! I almost, I almost got... I almost got Dawn killed! Why didn't someone warn me? Oh wait, was that what Hanako was doing? Wow. That could have gone really badly. We were all trying to... I completely forgot that she did physical damage. You're absolutely right. I'm sorry, Hanako, for timing you out when you were just trying to help me. Hanako was helping you. I thought she was trolling me. I thought she was trolling me. I thought she was trolling me. Also, uh, this is a little scary. Uh, this is a little scary. What does this guy have? Shouldn't be that dangerous. Let's just use a brave sword, I guess. Apology video incoming. I'm sorry, Hanako. I'm sorry, Hanako. I didn't mean to silence. Actually, I did mean to silence you. Also, uh, help, Brandon. Um, I guess I can rescue him. I mean, I can just rescue staff him. I'll be fine. All right, all right. Here comes Brianna. Hanako was actually trolling to kill you. you, you okay, she was trolling. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it, that woman. That woman trolled me. The map doesn't end in 12 turns. No, 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 I knew that. La 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 Cyrus is fine here. This is okay. Okay, now the Harbingers are charging. But they're gonna get murdered by Dawn. Hard. Should have put a few Twilight Tomes on these guys' pH. Rip Tomato John. Alright, can I? Okay. Okay, she's right in front of me now. Oh boy. I think I might have to... I think I might have to rescue Brandon, you guys. Manx, can you time out all women on stream to prevent more events like these? Oh, let's go, Voidwalker! Oh shit. Oh shit. Why would you go for this guy when you could go for Brianna? Wrong! Voidwalker, wrong! Yes, you were! Yes, you were, Hanako! You were trolling! Wow, these Voidwalkers are really good, what the hell? Does the Twilight Tome do damage to the user by reading Twilight to its victim? Yes. Okay. Well, these Void Walkers are kind of getting in the way. Yeah, oh my goodness. Thank you. Thank you, Chad. Um, Brianna's fucking scary. What the hell? Uh, I could try and... What if I try and lethality her, though? That would be kind of funny. But she kills Aubrey in one hit, so that's not very funny at all. Uh, yeah, she murders Dawn. Yeah, we need to get Brandon the fuck out of here. Get out of here. And Cyrus, you just go, um... Yeah, you're going to Fort Equip the Hellblazer. Uh, I think we just gotta retreat. I don't think I have any units that can kill Brianna at this moment. So I think I'll just... I'll back up. I'll just let the Void Walkers take the brunt of the damage. Uh, they cannot see snow. It's only it's only hold it's only keep Brandon alive, guys. It's fine. 
I'll send Carol. I, I actually, you know what? Yeah, I'll have to back up a little bit right here. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. It'll be fine, guys. Caroline in the arena. Let's go. in the arena the claymore gives her arena bonuses zero hits. wow that's funny that is actually so funny wow 20 level 20 silver sword master and the game doesn't know how to handle it at all They use magic to target defense, but they really aren't a problem, yeah. Final Final Omega Deluxe Edition ROM, yeah, exactly. The fakest of tension. Let's see if the White Walkers can kill Priya. <laughs> Rip Sari? Why would, why would Sari be in danger? Oh shit. No, it's fine. On Little Saga Turbo when? What? Turbo? Don't the hero and sages attack Sorry? No, they're not in range. That's fine. It's amazing Meng's managed to keep Little Net alive for 29 chapters. Yeah, that I'm I'm as surprised as you are. Okay, if all the Void Walkers just gang up on Brianna right now. Oh my god, they died! <laughs> Never mind. Void Walkers. Void Walkers got this, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> I can just sit back and let the Void Walkers carry. <laughs> wow! Oh, these Void Walkers are fucking cracked. What the hell? Void Walker best unit in the ROM. <laughs> Oh boy, this hellfire is your purgatory. Let it wash away your sins. Oh, oh wow, that guy's fucking dead. Oh my goodness. Wow, how much damage was that? How much damage? 168 damage, okay. No! Attack Brianna! Attack Brianna, goddammit! <laughs> the Void Walkers are just killing Brianna! Ah, this is why I think Chapter 29 can be done 0%, yeah. You just gotta keep the Void Walkers alive, that's all that matters. Wow. All right, looks like we might be okay here. Yeah, we just gotta wait for the Void Walkers to die and then we'll be fine. Oh wow, what? What? The fuck did you just do, Aubrey? What? Huh? It's, oh, I guess, I guess the silencer is set like that, isn't it? Final, final, Rom, let's go. What the actual fuck? 
Okay, well, I guess we'll just sit back and relax while we <laughs> walk her beat the map. She killed the crown. <laughs> Send an Ahmed. I can try and trick them with Ahmed. Yeah, you're right. Let's do it. Let's put Ahmed right here. Just gotta watch out so I don't accidentally put any other units in range. That would be awkward. Heal the Voidwalkers. I guess. Yeah, like, wait, I can do that. How can you beat Andaran Saga Chapter 29 but lose the Fire Emblem 7 run? Oh, Theo is capped, is he? I think he's actually capped. Yeah, you know what? You know what, Voidwalkers? You've done well. I will heal you. Ahmed could have killed one of those Heartbringers, really? Oh shit, he could. Wow, you're right, he could have. Well, I could use Halga, maybe? Ba da ba ba ba. Void Runners. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, Helga can kill with uh, Gale Force. You're right about that. Let's do it. Yeah, let's go. It's okay. Helga get kill. Helga much better. Uh, yeah. Okay. No, there's still a Sage left here. I gotta kill him with Aisha. Oh my god, look how bad Aisha's rest is. He deals 37 damage to her. The Voidwalkers are super good. It's ridiculous. I don't understand why people complain about Chapter 21 when these guys are a thing. Like, what the fuck? Get Brandon back? Brandon is fine, he's not gonna die. Dude. Voidwalkers can kill Kangux? I guess so. Matt, man, the map looks almost the same in heart, and he changes. Uh, on Lunatic, there's just... Enemies are way stronger, and there's more of them. It's really that simple. Here's the thing, though. I may have... I may have beaten Chapter 29, but Chapter 31 on Lunatic is a different beast entirely. I would go as far as to say that the final battle on Lunatic is worse than Chapter 29. Oh, boy. I really do think that, because it's balanced around having 18 units. I have 14. No, I have 13. Oh my goodness. Not on hard mode, on lunatic mode. Alright, well, can we just kill Brianna now? Maybe we can. Ahmed took one for the team. <laughs> 249 damage, let's go. Yeah, chapter 31 is ridiculous, it really is. Alright, let's see here. Okay. What about the Claymore? Okay. Alright, that's pretty good. If we can get Varg in here, maybe Darius with the Oonga Bonga Bali. Okay, we can we can definitely kill her. Oh, we can absolutely kill her. Oh, we can absolutely kill her. I'm gonna kill her with the Harbinger Sigil. Wait, what did I just do? Okay, this is fine. Zero hit, yeah, yeah. Hit points and skill. I'll get Jaka in there, just for betrothed. Now I kinda have to kill her, so I'm kinda, I'm kinda... But this is fine, yeah, yeah, easy, zero hit. Oh, she oh. <laughs> <laughs> What a unit. What a fucking unit. <laughs> <laughs> what a unit! 
What a unit, Morty, I'm so very sorry. Forgive your foolish wife. What a unit, ladies and gentlemen. What a unit. Alright, let's see if we can, um... And I think Aisha just capped out as well. Yep, here we go. Got ca capped Aisha. Let's go. Luck defense. Caroline, the new queen. Rise up. Uh, maybe we can go do some shopping with Daria. <laughs> let's, go. let's go to the arena. No, let's go to the arena with Amon. That's a perfect way to end this map. Shit. Get him, Ahmed. Kill that necromancer. You can do it. I believe in you. Oh shit, he gets doubled. He met Lion in the arena. Very sad. Very, very, very sad. Incredibly sad, you guys. Get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. No, wait, this is fine. This is fine. This is fine. Wait, what? No. No! God damn it. I didn't want to do that. Down star. I could have resummoned him. Yeah, I could have done that. I could have done it, guys. I could have done it. Kill Jaka Harbring. No, he's next to Varg with a barrier, dude. He's not gonna die. They're they're all gonna go for the Voidwalker. Will Voidwalker Sama serve? Okay, never mind. Yeah, they're going for for Caroline for some reason. Voidwalker survived, let's go! Mangs Beat Chapter 29, Lunatic Suboptimally, what's your excuse? It can be done. I would even argue Chapter 29 isn't that big a deal. I think people are just... I think people got a little... In no! Voidwalker, no! You go you were gonna live! You were gonna live, Voidwalker, no! No, Voidwalker. Unbelievable. Of Andaron's five whole the combined might of Andron's five noble houses. Worthless military trash heaps. You've lost this battle, Alexander. Surrender like the good dog you are. Maybe I'll give you a quick death. The victory belongs to you, but allow me to make a proposition. I have no desire to die here. Is this where you're going to beg and plead for your life? I don't plan on begging for anything. I'm simply going to offer you a trade. Let me live and I will tell you what I know about Mortimer's plans. You would rather rot in jails in a jail cell than die on the battlefield? You're sadder than I imagine. Only imbeciles throw away their lives for things such as honor. I'm more pragmatic than that. I could just have you tortured, it's no less than you deserve. You could, but how long would it take for me to break? Do you have that kind of time? Seems like you're on the clock. You have two options, kill me like a dog or spare me and I'll tattle on Mortimer. Where are you? I take the easy path out. Alright chat, what are we gonna do? Oh wow. 73% yes, okay. You're a dishonorable dog, Alexander, and I don't make deals with traitors. I have no way of even knowing if what you tell me is true or not. Aha, I see. Well, it was worth a shot. Go ahead, then. Kill me quickly. I shall not give you the satisfaction of pleading for my life. Oh shit, he just walked into him. What the fuck? I learned this move from Tendaris. Hope you enjoy the show bout. Oh, Fred is not even alive to chastise him. We managed to capture Queen Brianna as she attempted to flee the battle. Sadly, we did not manage to recover her regalia. She was able to cast a spell. It vanished before we recover, could recover it. What would you have us do with her? 
Well, this is quite the catch. A valuable prisoner indeed. You're wrong. Capturing me will not change anything. You're telling me Mortimer does not care if you live or die? Of course he does, but he won't give up everything just for my sake. His goals are beyond your comprehension. I don't care about his goals. All he wants is more power. You don't see that your actions will bring eternal darkness to Andalon. Morty wants to restore the balance to Arura and save us from the demons. Yada yada, spare me the details. I have, no I have to decide whether to kill you. Doing so would not be wild, wise while he holds my mother and sister hostage. Perhaps I might be able to trade your life for theirs. Do what you wish, you're too late to stop Morty. Your family holds little value to him now. We'll see about that. Guards, take her away. My goals are beyond your comprehension, yeah. I don't understand. Why did my Mortimer why did Mortimer let my family live? Doesn't seem that strange to me. Why why waste valuable hostages? Maybe he thinks he can use your family to bargain for his wife? No, we're missing a piece of the puzzle. Mortimer does everything for a reason. He's planning something big, and we need to make sure we're ready for it. Speaking of which, what's our next move? Are we going to lay siege to Malthrak? I need some time to think on the matter. We'll rest here for a bit. Let us know when you're ready. Indeed. Now if you'll excuse me, I need to see someone. My machinations lay undetected for years. Draco, my boy. I c I'm so sorry. Words cannot express. I failed to protect little Femke, and Ella too. No, Brandon. I'm the one who should be apologizing. Why do you say that? I should never have put this load on your shoulders. I knew the sorts of people I was up against. Still, I dragged you into it. I know that each member of your crew is like family. I put them all in danger. Jim Jim died because of me. Don't be so hard on yourself, Jacka boy. I accepted the job knowing what it was. If anything, the blame should be mine. I just have to face Galahad. Then I have to find Mortimer. Neither of those will be easy. Ah, uh, by the way, I was told to give this lance to you. Oh, that's an excellent spare. How did he come to possess it? Remember the Lightbringer loyalists who came out of hel hiding to help us? One of them approached me during the battle and handed it to me. He told me it was important that I give it to you directly. He said you'd need it when the time comes, whatever that means. Crypting as always, but I suppose it would make sense for them to help. If they wanted you to have this weapon, then it's probably for a good reason. Thank you, Brandon. I'll take it with me. Finally, Jaka gets this legendary weapon. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. Dire Pursuit. Should I do it tonight? It would be nice to have the final chapter for one stream. But first, obviously, we gotta do the meme review. Hey, I did it, though! I fucking beat chapter 29! I beat chapter 29! Deathless chapter 29 even. It can be done, ladies and gentlemen. It was I was pretty nervous there for a while. I was pretty nervous there for a while. But uh, I was able to um, I was able to sweep and get 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 control of the enemies. I was very intense, my goodness. <laughs> Alright, let's look at some memes. I wish to send Mang some meme. Well, you've come to the right segment, then. Mang and Bethany living in Norway, like... <laughs> we actually did have a picnic outside on the day that I proposed. I'm the dumbest man alive. I made a hidden turn counter requirement to get chapter 32. You're clearly dumber! <laughs> wow. What is my purpose? To bring me Pepsi. <laughs> <laughs> she did right before I proposed she sang the Naruto she started singing the Naruto 
When I'm in a being <laughs> when I'm in a being cringe competition and my opponent is katana mix. Lovely. Buy Bethany a ring. Find the right time to propose. She starts singing every time. <laughs> If only you knew how bad things really were, lad. No canto? Hong Kong, yeah. <laughs> uh, oh, damn, that's a good Christina. Look at that. Which is more worth it? <laughs> Aubrey. Is Aubrey worth it, ladies and gentlemen? Is Aubrey worth it? Oh, let's see. We got a lot of memes to go through here. Oh my fucking god! Oh! <laughs> oh no, John! John has a Sonic True Medallion! I cannot unsee this! I cannot unsee this! Oh my god, that's where it ended up! <laughs> oh my god, the source of John's power has been discovered. He has the Sonic True Medallion. Oh my goodness, that is uncanny. I bet he's thinking about the violin of the coyotes, man. Can't oh, That's amazing. Harrier Samurai. I'm glad someone got the reference. I'm, I'm glad someone got the reference. That's great. I am a simp who believe in Caroline's supremacy. She got really good, my goodness. Oh my goodness. Coincidence? I, I think not. Me data mining the ROM with Fire Emblem Builder to find a way to recruit Randall and Astrid. <laughs> You can't recruit Ronald and Oster. If those kids could read, they'd be very, very upset. Yeah. Oh, uh, let's see. Oh, boy. Unhand me, Beth. I said, unhand me! Yeah, no one touches my Pepsi. With Castle Malachor successfully taken, Jaka prefers to march on the capital! Oh no, Jaka! No! <laughs> Mordor will, ne will never stop investigating you for this. When the shield is great, bottom texts, indeed. I think I was banned by PH for this message. I refuse to say silent and let PH silence me for this. Make sure PH doesn't shadow add horse slayers to the arena in the final, final, final ROM. Let's actually go and see if PH actually banned you for that. But let's actually find out. I I'm, I'm curious now. We're, gonna, we're actually going to go into the, into the YouTube studio. And we're going to see if you are on the ban list. If you are, that's hilarious. Uh, let's see, community, ban lists, uh, here we go, here it is. My goodness, there's so many bots on here. Alright, let's see, so, you, your username is, uh, your username is Sabami? Are you on the, you are not. There is no one, like, I don't think you were banned, you might, 
You might have been you might have been timed out. You might have been timed out, but there's no one named Sabami on the ban lists. Oh, you temporary ban him. Why did you temporary ban him for saying that, PH? Why are you a mod? Why 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 do I let you mod my channel, PH? You, you can't, PH, you can't time people off because they annoy you. I sh I can, but you can't, you can't time out people for saying, like, for <laughs> saying bad things. Like, I guess you can. If they say bad, I, I, I give up. Do -do 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 -do. He is French. This is very true. <laughs> Thanks, <laughs> Kant. This is how you look when you scream Kanto in chat. When you scream Kanto in chat, this is what you look like, chat. Mang's cool strategy, Kanto. <laughs> Okay, that's good. That's really good. That is fantastic. On that day, humanity received a grim reminder. Oh my- <laughs> Oh, that's so good! What the fuck? That's actually good. That- That is actually so good. What the hell? Oh, we got some more memes. Why is this so funny? What the hell? <laughs> oh, Androsaga, the land of Bordheim. That's oh, that might be a. Is that a book? Suicide is badass. Ahmed thinking he would be the one to die most number of times in Mangus Iron Man, some random old noble from House Rose. <laughs> there is no Easter Bunny, there is no Tooth Fairy, and there is no secret character. No! No! <laughs> what is the Samuel? <laughs> what is the Samuel? Alright, I think that's all the memes. Let me just make sure I didn't miss any. Uh, I can't see anyone. Uh, Alright, you know what? I would very much like to have the final chapter for one stream, so you know what? We're doing chapter 30. We're doing chapter 30. And then we're gonna do the final chapter on Friday, I think. I don't think I'm gonna do it on Tuesday, because we got some plans on Tuesday. Oh, donations. T Lord donated 10 bucks. Well done, Mangs, for Deathless29. Thank you. Paisandu donated 20 to Super Jack. Congrats, Egg. It was amazing to see Chapter 29 Deathless. Thank you. Brandon Williams donated 999 to Super Chat. Congratulations on beating Chapter 29. It's only hard in the beginning, but if you know what you're doing, it's not too hard. Just need careful planning and getting rid of leadership stars. Yeah, that's huge. Noel donated 20 bucks for Super Chat. Congrats on beating Chapter 29, Deathless. Even. Now, you only need to beat the next couple of chapters. Yeah, thank you so much, guys. I mean, Chapter 30 is can be a little scary sometimes, but it's, it's definitely not as hard as Chapter 29. But Chapter 31 is much worse. I need to keep everyone alive. We need to have a death. I cannot lose anyone right now. If I lose the character now, that's gonna make chapter 31 much, much worse. 
Mortimer's gambit has failed, and Andran's noble houses have fallen to ruins. However, Jaka's family was taken by Galahad before the battle began. Standing outside Holtmeyer's gate, Jaka must decide his next course. Yeah, I wish I had Isabel. That would be so nice. Hmm? Clock? No, I'm just ignoring him. Yeah. But where did he send... Where did the clock send... Did he send them on, like... Like, Discord? I didn't see... Clock, just send me your memes to Discord, okay? Tendaris, you have any news for me? Sure do, boss. We've recovered the bodies of the slain Andra nobles. We discovered they had notes planted on their corpses. We suspect the Thieves Guild members are the culprits. What did the notes say? Commander Jacka's family is being held at Castle Steel. Come if you want to save them. You think it's a trap? I contacted one of my spies in Maltrak using my spatial tone. We've confirmed that Galahad rode south to Castle Steel. Mordemir returned to Maltrak. Galahad took my mother and sister. It seems they are at Castle Steel. But do we know if Mordemir truly went to Maltrak? He has clones. We can't confirm his true location. He could have traveled anywhere. If we're lucky, we might stumble onto a lead, but for now... Jaka, are you alright? My sister is young and naive. My mother is old and frail. I don't know if I can think about them objectively. We need to pursue Mortimer, but my family... There is nothing scarier than losing a beloved family member. I lost my mom when I was young. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. She was assassinated. Part of some political game, no doubt. We never even found the murderer. I don't want any of my friends to suffer the same loss I have. We'll pulse our pursuit of the king to save your family. If anyone complains, I'll just spit some dragon fire on them. There was a time when I didn't like damn humans all that much. You showed me I used to act pretty ignorantly, Tendaris. Thanks for being my friend. Thanks for being mine. Now let's get on with saving your family. Ooh. Ah, don't forget to like the stream. You guys are nice. Ah. Ah. On his way to Andoron, Jaka travels through the coastline. This brings him to a place he has not seen in over a year. Along with Baudemon, he helped to stave off a Viking raid. Many lives were saved as a result of their heroism on that day. But now, all that remains is... Don't forget to dislike the stream. Hanako, don't make me time you out again. Nine Divines, what happened here? This place is like a graveyard. Right, let me close this one real quick. Uh, sorry, I have the I have the ban list. Uh, let's see. There we go. Do... Oh. I just did an oopsie. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I um uh, I just I just deleted my entire ban list. <laughs> Everyone's <laughs> Oh no. Oh shit. Uh Ooh. Wait. Oops. Uh Okay, uh, mods be a little wary. I I just we just like unbanned 800 bots. So, uh hopefully they're not still in my chat botting. If they are, we're gonna see a lot of casino rolls show up, but... Um... I literally opened the floodgates. Yeah, I did. Uh... I was gonna close my ban list, and I, I clicked on, like, delete everyone, and I clicked save before I realized what I did, so... Um... Everyone got unbanned, so have fun with that, I guess, mods. I'm just gonna keep playing. Look around, these villages were raised to the ground. This is not the work of us northerners, I promise. You're right, I see good equipment strewn about. Vikings wouldn't leave such valuable loot behind. Did Mortimer do this to send us a message? Perhaps this is revenge for beating him at Holtmeyer. The stench of death is not strong here. These villages were burned a while ago. I suspect the bodies may have been rotting for perhaps two or three weeks. Why would Mortimer genocide his own citizens, his own people? 
See that twisted of a monster? Does he enjoy killing for fun? Mortimer is ambitious, but not stupid. I think there's a better explanation. Maybe an uprising occurred here, similar to one that I was in Hopemeyer? Whatever it is, we won't find out until we ask him ourselves. I don't care what that snake has to say. He don't deserve to explain himself. I'm going to run my lance through his chest before he gets to open his mouth. Oh boy. Casino bot. Jaka marches on Castle Steel with the discovery of Mortimer's deeds to freshen his memories. Hanako, no! Don't pretend to be a bot. You'll get banned. He chases after Galahad's trail to rescue his mother and sister, hoping he'll reach them in time. Soon he draws near the castle, expecting an ambush. But fortunately, he discovers that the Steel Knights will never resort to such cowardly tactic. Galahad's men fear no invaders, and as such, they sit patiently to await the Lord of Lance's assault. Commander Galahad, the Lord of Lances is drawing near. Our men are fresh and ready for battle as you commanded. Good, open the gates and allow him to enter. Hmm? Are you feeling my well? Well, my lord, you appear disturbed. Oh, it's this hostage business. It leaves a sour taste in my mouth. I won't let it fight the king, but his tactics certainly bother me. I agree, Steel Knights should not coerce our enemies with hostages. These methods are better left to the wretches of the lesser houses. Indeed, perhaps it is merely our king's flame guard blood at work. He takes after his mother and odd more than his father, I imagine. The king has demonstrated great compassion for his citizens. Who are we to question his ways? Speak truth. In any case, get ready for Jaka's arrival. Alert me when he breaches the castle entrance, my lord. Put the ban list on the death counter? Yeah, sure. They left the front gate open. Galad seems to fare no one. Welcome to Castle Steel, Lord of Lances. It's been a while since I saw you. I remember chasing your ragged bands of miscreants through the royal dungeons. You looked quite terrified back then, like puppies caught soiling the rug. Galahad, you bastard. Where are my mother and sister? What have you done to them? Calm down, I don't harm the innocent. I've taken good care of your sickly mother. I even had our doctors attend to her needs. As for your sister, she is a lovely flower. I've treated her as, a, as if she was my own daughter. And why did you threaten to kill them both at Holtmeyer's gate? Ah, Mortimer wondered if you'd be stupid enough to walk out on us. He had no intention of harming them, you should know his own feelings. He and Baudemont were quite close to Maria, he'd never hurt your mother. But he killed his beloved brother. Right, anyway, let us not delay the inevitable. Girl, you may come out. Jaka, you came for me! Femke. You see, she's doing just fine, not one here out of place. What are the conditions for my family's release? It's simple, you just have to attack my men and make it inside quickly. If you don't, you'll never see your mother or sister again. What? You say you never hurt an innocent person? I'm not going to hurt them, Jaka. I'm going to ship them, ship them somewhere. Somewhere far, far away where you won't ever see your family again. That is, unless you can reach and defeat me before it's too late. Why are you playing all those games with me? Is this some sort of psychological torture? I'm simply slowing you down, boy. Giving my nephew time to prepare. If I could kill you, that would be even better for Mortimer's goals. But in the end, you won't be able to outwit the King of Andalon. I've come to realize he's a genius when it comes to the art of war. And as for you, you're nothing but a peasant playing prince. When I make it to the other side of that gate, you're a dead man. You helped engineer Bout's death. I'll make sure you suffer. <laughs> scary kid. Why is Femke red? Because otherwise you could just rescue her. Everyone, get ready to swarm Castle Steel. We'll have to split up and assault both wings. Take no quarter. Kill Galahad's defenders. Alright, here we go. 14 out of 14? Are we, are we, do we actually have... <gasps> no, okay, 15. 15 out of 15, okay. Well, it was good. It was kind of fun while it lasted. Uh, so I actually need to, I need to buy a preparations dagger, I think. I don't know if I have any daggers, because I sold them all. Or do I have any daggers? I do not, but, I mean, to be fair, Aubrey can use killing edges. It's just more fun with... Yeah, honestly. Let's give her a killing edge, why not? Do, 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 do. But I'll get her a I'll get her a dagger from the armory as well. Look, you can use Darius to visit the armory. Let's go get a dagger. And let's also get a chest key. Oh, oh, we have we have Aubrey right now. We don't actually need it, do we? Let's see, we have uh, we have this door right here, so we will send Aubrey on the right side, and then there's like this little treasury here with the door, so. Do we still, do we have any unlock staves? Do, 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 
we do not. So as long as we have a door key on our guys, we should be fine here. So here on this map, you want hard-hitting tomes. You want Fenrir. You want Fenrir tomes. They are absolutely amazing for this map. And there are boots here too, for sure. So let's take a look. Yeah, this is Galad on Lunatic. It's pretty terrifying. And you have Steel Knights. Yeah, these guys are very strong on Lunatic. They got capped stats. But overall, this, this, this chapter can kill you if you're not careful, but it's not. You should be able to deal with it. Do -do -do. Yeah, definitely Aura here. Maybe even Divine? What happens if you kill Femke? You can't. There is no way you can kill her. There is absolutely no way you can kill her. Ragnarok Helga? Oh, 100%. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Actually, I still want Dolem. Uh, I still want Dolem to reduce their defense of Galahad if need be, but yeah. Ragnarok Helga, 100%. Although I might want to change, I might want to spare, I might want to keep hold on to that for the final battle. You'll maybe, I'm not sure. Do -do 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 -do. I earned the warp staff. Oh, I guess you could, yeah. Now, the moment you warp someone inside, I think he turns. I think she turns green. I'm not sure actually. Yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, you can use warp staff. Why did PH put that stupid warp staff in the game? It's, it's there's so many dumb things you can do with it. Okay, so we'll send uh, we'll send Aubrey this way. Jocka can open the door, I guess. Cyrus this way together with John. Dawn this way as well. Uh, yeah, Dawn can go to the left. If you lose in chapter 31, will you restart or will you take a break? Let's not talk about such things. Our intel says that the doors here can't be opened by conventional means. I love this track. They can only be opened from the opposite by flipping a lever. The Steel Knights will guard those points with everything they have. We'll need to split into two groups. Now go, hurry, and reach Galahad. Aw, oh, yeah. Does he still have the holy symbol? He does. I'll barrier up Tendaris first and foremost. Uh, you can have the shine. No! God fucking damn it. Wrong target. John! John, wrong target. This chapter scares me. It's pretty scary. And before reinforcements come out of the stairs. Uh, there are no re- I mean, there are some reinforcements on this map, but overall, there's not many. Supports? Uh, I don't think there's any supports left. I would be very surprised. Nope, Theodore Alonda. That's that's about it. Theodore Alonda. That's the only ones that are left at this point. Alright, Cyrus goes here. And then I think everyone else goes this way. Let's go, Caroline. <laughs> Uh, maybe I should be a bit more cautious sending her into, like, four Steel Knights, but... This map was really easy. I mean, it's, it's, it's less challenging than Chapter 29, for sure. Especially when you got a decked out party. I mean, look, look how broken Pandara is, is with the barrier and how it does support. Alistair against the Steel Knights will be fun. Imagine having to watch that animation for a time. You see, I actually begged uh, PH to not make the Alistair a Brave Tome. Because I was like, dude, it's gonna take for fucking ever. 
And he's like, no, that's fun, haha. <laughs> Alright, nice. Turn this, uh... Turn this softening up the Steel Knights, that's good. Oh, hi. <laughs> I didn't realize this guy was attacking me. Ba -ba 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 -ba. But you gotta be careful. I mean, here's the thing about Chapter 30, though. It's definitely easier than Chapter 29, but if you get complacent, you can very easily lose a unit. And if I lose a unit, that's really bad. Uh, I need every I need every single unit for Chapter 31. Because you know how that chapter is. Mortimer will, like, drown you in illusions. You need units to kill them. And I don't, I don't have the Gale Shot. I, have, I will have 15 units. Now, 14 units total. It's a map with 18 deployment slots. It can be rough. Maybe ban people who say I'm free. Nah, it's okay. If they don't break any rules, they can get a second shot. Is Galahad here if you kill him in Chapter 13? Yeah. He revives or something. I don't know. Won't you get a... Oh, yeah! I'll have Ilonda. That's true. Yeah, so I'll have 15 units out of the 18 possible. That's still really scary. That is, like, still super scary. Alright, looks hostile. Let's go. Yeah, YouTube I literally has an option to clear your entire ban list. I, I knew it was there, I just forgot about it. <laughs> oh wow, look at Aubrey though, what the hell? What a unit. Mangs, what's the difference with Lux Hosta and Allspies? Uh, Lux Hosta is just a really strong spare. It has 16 might, 90 hit, 15 crit, and it debuffs defense by 4. So it's just a very... it's just a very strong... oh my goodness. I know hammers aren't effective, but it doesn't matter. Aisha doesn't care. Give Aubrey a Brave Sword? I'll rather save it, I'd say. Oh, nice! FE4 Weapon Triangle, let's go! Lux Hosta Copy Pasta, let's go. Do we just fuck it? I mean, we might as well use the Void Flare for what it's worth in this chapter because. Might as well get Varg to level 20. Honestly, yeah, I should focus on getting everyone in my squad to level 20 before the final battle. Oh, wait, Varg is level 20. Is, e is everyone on my squad level 20? Sorry, it's not. Uh, John is not. Everyone except for John and Sari, and Jaka, actually, of all people. So we definitely want to make sure we give kills to John. Uh, oh, yeah, you know what? You know what? That holy symbol? I think maybe it's time for that holy symbol to go on John. How many eternal seals do you have left? Uh, you get one in this chapter. Yeah, Darius is also not level 20. You're right about that. He's only level 16. I had to give him more kills. I definitely need to give him more kills. song is called Pure Steel. No, it's called a Tide of Steel, Hanukkah. Pure Steel is the battle theme that, like, many members of the Steel family uses. Alright, let's do a fiery chant on John. I feel like he deserves it at this point. Aw, oh, come on, John. Get a crit here. There you go. Adrenaline pumping for no reason whatsoever. Uh, compared to Chapter 29, this is a walk in the park, but it, it is very important that I don't get complacent here. Because again, chapter, 30, to chapter 30, it's very sneaky. It can very easily kill one of your units if you're not paying attention. So it's it's gotta be very... like placing a... it's almost a little cruel to place a 
quote-unquote easy chapter after a hard one, because it's almost like it's designed to kill off one of your units. Now Helga can take this, this is fine. Jones crit rate is so sporadic. Yeah, well he has a fire chance, so. Oh, nice Helga, that might be a kill actually, and a Gale Force. Oh no, she needs one. Oh no, she won't get it, fuck. You see, like suddenly, without you realizing it, you don't have enough to kill, and then suddenly it just all goes to shit. It's really annoying. Wait, 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 wait. Oh shit, he has a brave one. You see? You see what I mean? I think I have to rescue John now, don't I? How much does it do with the Brave Land? 10? 37 with the Brave Lands. 37 minus 20, that's 17 times. Oh, John takes it. Never mind, he takes it. He takes it so well, actually. And there's a chance I might just... Yeah, he takes it. And also, Tendaris might just bonk him. Should have killed the Thoron. Yeah, uh, I'm scared right now. I don't think he can kill any of my guys. He might kill Cyrus, actually. Oh boy. No oh, fuck. Never mind, Cyrus has a uh, Cyrus has a holy symbol. But you can see, like, you see what happens when you start to fall asleep on this chapter. Like, it'll just kill you. It'll just fucking kill you. But yeah, I have to give Darius levels here. I need to give him Steel Knight's kills as as much as possible. I do need to try and save the Ungubunga Bali, though. I need to try and save it, because it's very good in the final map. So we want to use the... we want to use the Fenrir Tome here. That's beautiful. Lance Knights have lower rest, Axe Knights have lower... I know, I know. I know, I'm just lazy. Alright, that's very good. It would be nice to get Darius to level 20 before the final battle. Like, get everyone to level 20 before the final battle. So I should definitely focus on that. Um, yeah, you, you see this fucking shit right here? See this fucking shit right here? Let's place Theo here. Let's heal up Ahmed as well. Mang's not using his Regalius. Well, I'm trying to train up the guys that still have experience to get, you know? Look at that. Look at this crit rate right here. Mang's aren't Regalia. Yeah, they're repaired. I don't- I'm not- con I'm not conserving the Regalius, guys. That's not what I'm doing. I'm not- I'm not conserving the regalias, guys. That is not what's going on here. What I am doing is I am trying to feed kills to the units in my squad who are not level 20 yet. On the right side is gonna be John. On the left side is going to be Darius. And... yeah, that's pretty much about it. Uh-oh, the forest's change is real this time. I can't even stop shaking, it's so intense. Are you- are you okay? Are you okay? Are you having a heart attack? If you- if your adrenaline is pumping so much from watching a stream, maybe- maybe stop. That's actually a very cool thing to say. Sorry. Uh, that's very- I shouldn't say that. People with anxiety might- might- might get really- might get really peeved by that. So, sorry, I didn't mean to do that. Is that dude gonna die? Theo? No, he's gonna be fine. There you go. Hamurn the Uga Bunga. Uh, I definitely have to Hamurn something before this is over. I'm not sure what, though. Oh, love boy. You know what? Getting a fuck. No? Still doing it? Okay, still going on. PH, why'd we make all the store break you, know? you see this shit? You see this shit right here? 
Is this good game design, PH? Fantastic game design, PH. Yeah, not doing that, that's for sure. Can the Unga Bunga Tome, uh... 22 damage. Is there any way we can, like, just do a little bit of damage? I said a little bit of damage. Rawr. Don't kill him, Aisha. Don't kill him. Just do a little bit of damage. Okay, just a little bit of damage. No, Dawn, a little bit of damage. No. I want to feed this to Darius. Oh no, definitely not doing Claymore, that's for sure. Uh, this might actually work. Maybe Thunder? No, Wind. She's gonna kill him. That's the problem here. Jaka's gonna kill too. Alright, what about Varg? Ugh. Ugh. Why is this so hard? Okay, what if I use a Brave Sword? Ah, that works, right? This won't kill. Oh, John Connie's. Ah, he's gonna hit level Connie, it's fine. I'm giving Theo Adept in the rebuild. It's a great suggestion from DS Noon. I'll also give him Astra. I think PH is fucking with you guys. I think I think I think that's uh I think I think PH is fucking with you guys. This doesn't seem uh Oh my god, this guy quads Darius, what the fuck? Astralostore! <laughs> Astralostore! Oh my goodness. Astralostore. That sounds absolutely horrible. How did you manage to make such great boss teams, Manx? I didn't make this. Tumbo and Treatstar made this. Our two musicians, they're super talented. 40 Alastor in a row, yeah. Okay. If Theo had adept an Al if Theo had adept and oh shit okay fine this is fine if Theo had adept and an Astra how many Alastors could he theoretically have procked in a row? All right, we want to give this one to John. Does he get quoted? Okay, he does not. So, um, can Sari reach? We need to we need to we need to move in with the with chicken tendies first. I don't like that crit. I really don't like that crit. Oh boy. Let's see, let's do the Brave Axe first to What about Helga? What can you do? Oh my goodness, this guy is super strong. What the fuck? Ugh. What the f Ah What is going on? Yeah, Tendaris, maybe you should, uh... Okay, you know what? I think we can do this. Hellblazer running low. You put too many units on the left side. Maybe, maybe Lilinette should just... Yeah, I think I kind of imba unbalanced my team a little bit. I do have my Dancer on this side, though, so that's something. Yeah, he can get 40 Alastors in a row. How many seconds? Can someone count how many seconds it takes for one Alastor animation to play? And then calculate how long it would take for Theo to cast 40 Alastors? If his enemy could even survive that many, that is. I mean, that is a big if, I guess. If, if his enemies could even survive that many. If I crit here, it's still not going to be enough. I might have to borrow the uh, the holy symbol. 
onto a, onto a Fenrir here. If I do this, it'll probably be a kill. Or an Asperatu, maybe? That'll be 30. Is that a yaw? Oh my... Oh, why? Oh, okay. Wait a minute. Alright, let's do it. Is she gonna crit? I hope not. I want this kill to go to John. Magnus, what do you think of Attack on Titan? Uh, loved Season 1, lost interest after Season 1, like I think a lot of other people. Hmm? Steel Knights above? Ah! Ah! <laughs> oh shit! You're right! Oh my goodness! Oh, there's Steel Knights above! Oh! Whoa, 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 whoa. Do we have a rescue? Oh shit. Oh shit. Ho you see? You see this. This chapter doesn't fuck around. Okay, we can rescue Helga, it's fine. And John can get the kill here, which is nice. Uh, I think John has a rescue stab. Even if he doesn't, I have Lulinette and the Dancer, I should be fine. Yeah, you see, this is why I need to really not get complacent. Hit point skill, luck and defense. Really wish John could get some speed, but his speed growth is pretty trash. Um, yeah, so what I can do is I can rescue Helga with Lulinette, and then I can dance. I mean, as long as Tandaris doesn't die... Which... Oh! Oh boy. Um... He can definitely take it at full health, so... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then I can dance with Sari here, so this is fine. And then I'll Physic Tandaris, yeah. And I'll give him Demosel as well, so... Uh, he doesn't die to a Fimble Vetter at full health. Definitely not. Oh yeah, no, like, this fucker has 80 HP and 30 res. He's gonna be absolutely fine. A little scary, though, I will admit. Kanto! <laughs> Kanto! Yeah, no, this is, this is really fine. I mean, I'm tempted to recover, but, uh, I mean... Lilinette takes a... She's not gonna get double. These guys have... Wait... 11 speed. Yeah, she's fine. She has four- yeah, honestly, Lilinette can go onto the throne, and she can freaking recover. She can freaking recover, Tendaris. Kanto, more like Kanto. Yeah, sure, why not? Boost leadership bonus to three or at least two points. Uh, we didn't want leadership to be two. What? Oh no! Why did I put her on the throne? Oh no! I, I told you this chapter, man! Oh my goodness, Theodore. Oh. Uh. Oh boy. Can he be attacked by another guy? Totally can. What? Oh, they're going for Ahmed. That's amazing. Oh my goodness. I think the guy with the axe is going to heal. I think the guy with the axe is going to heal. 
I think the guy with the axe is going to heal. Can confirm 40 Alastor spells would take over 5 minutes to animate. That's really funny. <laughs> you see what I mean about this chapter? You stop thinking for a second, and you risk losing units. This chapter is very stealthy, which is ironic for it being like a battle against Steel Knights, which are not necessarily stealthy. But this chapter feels stealthy in that you stop thinking for a moment and he just fucking kills you. Should we go for a should we aim for lethality? See if it works. Let's try this guy. Please turn off Alistar animations. No, never. You will be forced to watch Alistar until the end of time. Brave Sword Aubrey, actually a good idea. That's twice as many chances to proc lethality. Yeah, I agree. Oh, let's claymore it up. Let's go. Let's fucking go. Mang support epilepsy? Yeah. It's... Peshkot's 25% lethality. Yeah, I probably should use Peshkot's. I just don't want to waste it. But you're probably right. Oh my god, I nearly fucked up. I can't believe how close I came to fucking up. You should have earned the Alastor so we can enjoy more of the Thunder Goose. Uh, Alastor will be hammered, so it's fine. Alright, I'm just setting up another kill for Darius. My brother in Christ, this is the second to last chapter. Stop hoarding! <laughs> Never! Who designed this map? Oh, who do you think? Who do you think? Oh shit, I actually need to stop fucking around. They're still stealing us all I'm alive here. I need to stop setting up fucking kills for these guys. Okay, uh... I think Jaka with looks hosta copy pasta is probably what we want here. Ooh, that 5% crit is not nice. It's just not nice. Um, yeah, there's still three fucking Steel Knights here. Honestly, I'm thinking an Aura Tome on Dawn might, might not sound so bad right about now. I don't have any healing on Jaka. It's actually kind of a problem here. I guess I'll heal- oh, there we go. Very good. I think I'll have to summon Ahmed. Yeah, I'll have to summon Ahmed. Ooh. Um. I like the story. I quit at 14, can't finish it, but I'm really enjoying Meng's playing it. You can do it, I believe in you. 23, 44, 60. That's a kill exactly. What the hell? What about this one? Time. He's not gonna die, is he? Oh my goodness. Uh, yeah, let's... Can I at least kill one of them? Oh, I got Shamshir Ahmed, really? Uh, I'm a little bit scared right now. I don't know about you guys, but... I'm not liking this. This guy has a Thoron on him. He'll go for Ahmed, though. As long as I can kill this guy, I think we should be fine. You know what? Let's go for it. There we go. One crit. Shit. Oh no. <gasps> no! Yeah, they'll go for Ahmed if they, if they can't kill me though. Aisha might die. 
Oh, Aisha might die here. Oh, damn, $100. Man, that's crazy. Alright, so that's a lot of stuff coming towards me. I don't know if I can kill these guys. Maybe we just put Cyrus on the throne and hope for the best. Here's the thing, though. John on the... Nah. 21 damage. Can I reach with a physic on the other side? No, I cannot. Joey donated a hundred bucks to Super Chat. Congratulations, Manx and Bethany. Wishing you both well. P.S. Loving Andron Saga and the streams. Thank you so much, Joey. My goodness, you guys have been so generous. Thank you so much. It's been so many nice congratulations rolling in. It, it warms the heart. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it. $100 for Aisha's funeral, no! Oh boy. Yeah, this is pretty bad. I think if we put John here, then we can do this with Tendaris. First time donation, too. Thank you. Yeah, Tendis will get his healing, don't worry. Let's get that barrier staff going. If we barrier up John and give him Demacel against these Steel Knights, he should absolutely wreak havoc here. Thanks for supporting our egg guys. My currency is worth crap. <laughs> oh, do you have one of those funny, funny currencies? Sometimes I'll get like a dough of like 80,000 plum, and I'm like, whoa! 80,000 plum! And people are like, Manx, that's two dollars. I'm like, oh. Okay. Wow, 500 million Zimbabwean dollars! Thanks, guys! <laughs> Thanks, guys, appreciate it! Uh. Alright, let's drop you off maybe here? <gasps> uh oh. <gasps> no, it's okay, we're good. We're good. Fucking Thoron, are you shitting me? Oh my god, oh my god, no, 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 no. Do I just put Cyrus on the throne and pray? I think I put Cyrus on the throne and pray, right? But, well, nah, they'll kill him. Oh, I am scared for Tendaris right now. He doesn't have the, he doesn't have the divine symbol. Maybe I can trick one of the knights into going for s John energy. Yeah, this th this Thorin guy might just kill Tendaris. That's what I'm kind of scared about right now. He has 29 rest, but I still think a Thorin crit might kill him. I'll put Cyrus here. We gotta keep him within John's support range. Do we maybe put Amon on the throne to try and keep him alive? I think they'll go for Ahmed. I hope they'll go for Ahmed. Someone might die this turn, you guys. Someone might die. Okay, no, they're going for Ahmed. That's great. And keeping Ahmed on the throne was definitely the smart move, I think. Ooh. Yeah, this is the scary part. Don't crit him. Tendaris, if you know what is best for you, please do not crit. Please do not crit, please. Thank you. Oh my god. Okay, only the Thoron guy can attack John now. I think? Oh no, shit. He can be attacked by another guy. Okay, no. No, he's going for... He's going for John. <laughs> John might actually murder this guy, though. What? Oh my god. Oh no. John is sweeping Steel Knights. That's not a good thing. That is not a good thing. Oh boy. Strength, magic, rest. Still not leveling speed, I see. Okay. Fine. 
five damage Thoron. Let's go. Oh my god, John is sweeping. He's sweeping. John is sweeping. He might just sweep this entire... Oh my god, he is sweeping. Oh my god, Chris Chan is... No, guys, John is not Chris Chan. He is Christ Chan, okay? He is, he is, he is a man of God. All right. Well, you can have your healing, it's fine. Yeah, the, the, the Sonichu medallion helped him out. He's got the Sonichu medallion, it protects him from bad, bad omens. Alright, well, at the very least, I think we can get a Darius kill out of this, which is good. Darius and John both creeping up at level 20. Murmur, donor to 10 bucks. Hey, man, is, is it true in Norway you use Texas as a slang for something that's crazy? Like saying that party was so Texas? We do. We actually... Um, I was with, in Oslo with Bethany and her parents today. And they actually asked me, asked us that as exact... Or, I think Bethany brought it up. And they thought it was super hilarious. Yeah, we do use Texas as a slang for, like, chaotic. Like, ah, how about a Texas? Like, oh, this is very, like... This is chaotic, basically. It's pretty funny. Yeah, nope. Nope. Nope! Caroline kill. There you go. This unit is pair and balanced. This run is so tech. Yeah, this run is pretty Texas. Why don't Andron's neighbors just take over? Because... Uh, because they're all allied with Jaka? That's why. Alright. And now we can... Let's show off your favorite animation again, guys. Oh, this is amazing. Oh, everyone's... F oh, never mind. Theo crit. Now it's only 40 minutes instead of 80. We say that in Sweden as well. You do? Oh, that's funny, because in Norway, when something sucks, we call it Swedish. <laughs> Simp Omega Crit. <laughs> the eternal, like, gotcha, gotcha argument for Norway is like, at least we're not Sweden. <laughs> Like, no matter how bad things get, we are not Sweden. Meng's <laughs> trying to start a war. PewDiePie's been shit-talking Norway for like 10 years. Alright. John Sweep. John Sweep. Let's go ho. It's been 400 years of Alistar animations. And there will be 400 more! Da, 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 da. Oh, Tandaris isn't level 20 yet. Oh, it's level 19! Would you look at that? That's kind of cool. A little bit wholesome, but kind of cool. I don't really want to break the Hellblazer, but at the same time, I'm getting it back for the next chapter, so I guess it's fine. I once mistook my school pediatrician for being Swedish. She told me kindly but firmly to never mistake a Norwegian for a Swedish person. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're right about that. John Sweeper! Half of the next stream is just going to be Alistar animations. You bet it will. And it's gonna be fun. You guys are gonna like it. Oh boy, we need to kill this guy. Um, he's the Fimble Vettel guy. I think we will just Ragnarok him, probably. I think we'll probably just Ragnarok this guy. There is no reason to conserve the Regalias. No, no, they'll get repaired before the final battle. Uh, but it might be some worth it to conserve it a little bit for Galahad, maybe? Just maybe a little bit. I'll wear shades for the Alistar stream. Yeah, that's important. 
You gotta do that. One crit, Helga? Come on. One crit? Alright. Guess this one goes to Cyrus. This one goes to Papa Cyrus. <laughs> Manx on the final map. Who added all of these status days? Yeah. Yeah. Manx, what's your favorite arc of Ambaran Saga? Story-wise, I think nothing really beats the first arc. I think, like, at the second... Like, I mean, the first arc is really split into two, really. I mean, you have, like, the... I would consider chapters 1 to 7 to be the first arc. And then I would consider chapters 8 to 14 to be, like, the second half of the first arc. Because the first arc really has two parts. And I think, in terms of story, very little compares to chapter 18 to 14. I think that is when Andron Saga is at, at its absolute peak, both story-wise. At least story-wise. I think, in terms of pure gameplay, I really do enjoy Timaeut. I really do. I, I think chapters 20, 21, and 22. I know Oof will, will get a seizure every time I talk about chapter 21. And chapter 21 is like, yeah, it, I, I get why people don't necessarily like it, but I actually think it's a lot of fun to play every time. And I got a new appreciation for chapter 25 when I played it during Iron Man. I haven't really enjoyed chapter 25 that much before, but playing it on Iron Man actually kind of... It was really t intense. It was in incredibly intense. Chapter 25 is like there's so many small things you gotta think about. The, the fucking dragons makes it impossible for you to just brute force it, because two dragons will kill any unit. So you can't just rush in. Strength, magic, luck and resistance on John. Still not leveling speed. I have a feeling he's never gonna level speed, but that's fine. You know what? I'll actually let John heal, because again... Let's see, how are we doing here? Oh, he's level 19 already. Okay, this is fine. This is absolutely fine. There was a poll on the Discord picking top five favorite chapters. I picked 24, 13, 14, 7. I think out of like the favorite chapters, I think like 13 and 7 are like commonly very, very generally liked a lot. I think 7 and 13 are probably the best Sandra Saga has to offer. I love Chapter 7. I know a lot of people don't like it, because it's very difficult, but I I always thought Chapter 7 was, was a very, very... I think it's PH's... I think it is PH's magnum opus. I think it is an extreme... Like, I know some people don't like that it, like, airdrops reinforcements in your face all the time, but I think the way it does it is very clever. And it's, a, and it's an escape chapter, so you need to push for... Oh, hi there. The difficulty is overhyped. Because Andalan Saga is actually very easy to trivialize, if you know how to, like, Andalan Saga is a very hard game on the surface, but once you know how to trivialize it, there's a lot of ways to break it. And I'm okay with that. I think it's, I think it's fun to break Fire Emblem games, and, like, I know PH continuously, like, ch like changes that. <laughs> but he definitely, like, whenever, P whenever someone discovers a fun strategy, PH comes in and nerfs it. That's just how it is, I guess. Uh, let's see, we gotta give a couple kills to Darius here, I think. Uh, or... We got an Umbra here. Gotta be a little bit careful here, because this guy... Awakening is fun to break, but not fun to play. I think this is the truest statement I've seen about Awakening. Ever, yeah. Awakening is a sandbox that is very fun to break apart, but it is not very fun to play, I, yeah. I mean, I still like Awakening, despite all of its stupid flaws. I actually have a dear place in my heart for Awakening. Uh, but it is a very... a very badly designed fire. I, I don't think there's any two ways about it. I enjoy beating Breaking Fire Emblem games to remove Chapter 6 boss drawn. Sweetie, we've been over this before. We've been over this before. That was a stupid strategy, and it was too easy. Now that she has the ring on her finger, the honesty comes out. No longer... No longer will she, uh... No longer does she try to hide it. 
Ooh, okay, this is a little nasty. I'm not a big fan of this. Um, Curse of Misandry. <laughs> Uh, okay, so, I guess we should wait, uh, who has the freaking chest keys? Oh shit, it's on Jaka, isn't it? I need to send, um, oh damn, wait, I think this guy, oh, oh I gotta send Jaka all the way over here now, that's kinda sucks, um, yeah, I really want what's in these two chests, I can't believe I fucked up like that, um, yeah, I'm gonna have to send Jaka over here, I guess, and back here, because I don't have any way to open that. I think this guy drops a door key, maybe? No, he doesn't. So, but yeah, we gotta open this. We gotta get. We gotta get this sorted out first. So, I have learned to hide some funny exploits because PH will nerf them. What? When our own beta testers will not report exploits because they don't want PH to remove them. Something has gone wrong. Mang, stop wasting time if MK is waiting. Ah, you got all the time in the world. 20 turns seems harsh? Nah, it's 20 turns to reach Galahad. That is super easy to do. Mang, will you stream your wedding? No, I will absolutely not stream my wedding, but I will probably make a video about it like I, I again I'm not really an IRL vlogger but I think my wedding is definitely a video that should have some I think making a small video about it maybe showing off the locale I think that would be nice I think having that on your channel is kind of wholesome you know I don't know if I'd like to I, it would it, I don't want to make like an extensive wedding video though like Showing off every like I I would just make something small and simple, you know. Like I got married. All right, John Sweep. The wedding alligator. I tried to tell you, but I was banned, lol. Well, why was you banned, lol? Ha ha! I'm gonna make a super original joke. Mang son Bethany obtained a Fire Emblem S support. Ha ha! It must hurt to be this original. The power of Sony Chu compels you. <laughs> oh. Alright, that's the Doris's final level. Let's go. Strength, magic, speed, resistance, let's go. I get one more eternal seal. I don't know who I should give it to, though. I have no idea who, sh who I should give it to. Woo! Check Tandara's stats. Yeah, I'll, sh I'll check him out. Maybe, maybe it's worth giving him a... Uh... Maybe it, it'll be worth giving him a, uh, let's see. I mean, a, an Eternal Seal would, would give him some more speed, which could be nice. Oh, wait, um... Uh... Alga? Is Tandara's gonna be okay? Bolganom plus um, he'll be fine. Yeah, so I think at this point I should probably send Aubrey this way. Send her over here and get get the chest with her. Jaka can open these with a chest key, so it should be fine. Man, so have you ever considered getting people to voice act Andron Saga characters for a video for promotional purposes? I have actually. It's uh, it's something that I was. I mean, I think now with the advent of AI voice, I could almost, like, do it as well, like, for free. I know people don't like AI, but it's like, I mean, it's a thing I could do. Uh, but yes, I... That is actually something that I was like, that would actually be kind of cool. You know? Alistair. Oh, it's time for your favorite animation, guys! It's time for your favorite animation, you guys.
the rock would... Ugh. Manx, have an AI play on Little Saga Iron Man. Do you think I don't think the AI could be on Little Saga on Lunatic mode. Absolutely not. Oh wow, base Theo, let's go. I don't know what's worse, the animation or the Mage Knight into the Oh yeah, no, this is this is the best. Alright, bungala 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 bunga. This animation is still cool. You know, you know what's even more cool? The main character of Rebellion Saga is from House Rose. He's a mage knight. <laughs> uh. Oh no, it's not Samuel. <laughs> Uh, no, 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 it's not, it's not someone you, it's not someone from Andron Saga. It's, um... La 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 la... Gideon, yeah. Gideon, he's Lilinat's father. And Samuel's son. Yep, Gideon, that's his name. He's Theo's cousin, yeah. Well, wrongfully, he's called Theo's brother in the supports. That's a mistake. He's definitely not Theo's brother. <laughs> Theo's wife's boyfriend, yeah. He is Theo's wife's boyfriend, yeah, that's true. What's Rebellion Saga? So, at some point, I'm gonna release a short, like, 10, 9 to 10 chapter prequel of Andron Saga during the Rebellion. It's going. It's going to show off, like, what happened during the Rebellion, stuff like that. It's going to just follow some... It's just gonna flesh out the, the game and the universe a little bit more. Oh shit, yeah. I like the, I like the, uh, the idea of making a shorter hack, because... Like, a 10 chapter hack, that's very manageable. But that's not a hack that's gonna, like, grow out of proportions. Why not just Baudemon? Well, I mean, who's to say Baudemon would not be in it, but making him the main character would... I mean, he certainly could, but, um... Can we recruit Randall there? Randall will be playable in that. I've already decided he's gonna be playable. Yeah, you, you'll get playable Randall, literally. Armor Knight Randall. You know, everyone is going to want Randall to be- Oh, he's going to be. Yeah, he's going to be. Yeah, like, 100% he will be. Oh boy. They've started moving. You know what that means, right? Rod on sweep! Alright, so... Uh, where's Aubrey? Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? Yeah, Aubrey. You get... Aubrey will start moving over here now. She'll get there in time, I guess. I hope. Well, ten turns, actually. That's quite a long time. Um, will she actually be fine? I'm not sure, actually. How many characters will Rebellion Saga have? I don't have, like, a specific number on hand, but considering there's going to be, like, around ten chapters, I wouldn't expect a roster as big as Andron Saga with, like, 50 characters. 30 maybe? Like 25, 30 characters? Depending on like maybe 20? I, I don't know. I, I, I really don't know. But I have a couple of characters mapped out already. Okay, I gotta be careful because stepping on this throne will open up. Yeah, ste stepping up this will open up the... Wow, this guy is like so difficult to kill. What the hell? How many MILFs will Rebellion Saga have? Considering Zelda Crafter is working on the portraits, a bunch. We'll probably get Armon and Caroline. Oh, who will? Oh, 
you will. Maybe I'll maybe I'll teach. Oh, you'll definitely will. I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna do a teaser. I'm gonna do a teaser. You get you get a bit of a teaser live 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 right here. There we go. Consider that a consider that a special treat. Zelda Crafter Force to DH a woman. Worst feeling ever. No wonder Jocko went for that. <laughs> oh boy, that's a 1% cred. I don't like that. Um, I don't like that at all. Do we do Ragnarok? There's a good chance we can get a cred. This guy's tough to kill, my goodness. Is it possible for us to give you playable characters if you want filler characters? Um, I'm not gonna have filler characters in my game, dude. Every character's gonna be handcrafted. Can you get one crit, Alga? Seriously? How old is this supposed to be from age 20 to 25? People don't change much. Uh, well, Rebellion Saga is like... It, it happens around 10 years before Andron Saga. 8 to 10 years. And Caroline is what, like, 30? And on the Saga one, so she'd be twenty. So she she'd look quite pretty different. Are we getting a sequel with Femka as the main character? <laughs> we'll see. Oh boy. Okay. So um, yeah, we are gonna we're gonna we're gonna put John on the throne, and we're gonna sweep. You scorch. Oh, I should have packed scorch. Why didn't I pack Scorch? And John. Yeah, it's five years since. So people say five years. I understand the confusion, but keep in mind, Andron Saga takes place five years after the rebellion was won, and the rebellion went on for five years. This means at the start of the rebellion, it's actually ten years, not five. So, yeah, when Andaron Saga is happening, there has already, like, Thorgrim has already ruled for, like, five years as king. So this is important to, this is important to know. Can they hit Sari? Uh, I will rescue her. Yeah, I gotta be careful with this chapter, man. Uh, I will rescue her. Um... So what do, what do we have here? We have Thorons. Hmm. I kind of want... Does Cyrus have the... Uh, yeah, no, John has the holy symbol, so he'll be fine here, but... I want to keep John within the support range, so I guess... I guess I'll have to do this. If one of them goes for Lilinette, that is fine. She has like a billion gazillion rests. And then we'll put Jaka down here. Uh, let's see, how are we going to do this? Yeah, well, someone needs a chest key. That's probably going to come. Maybe Theo will go get the chest key. Maybe Darius. Okay, so we have Brave Swords here and Thoron Lances. That is kind of scary. Uh... Probably want to barrier up Darius, I imagine. He's gonna deal with 26 rest is quite a lot. We could also just give him a pure water. This is Oh young Albert? You bet. Oh you bet. Oh boy, uh, this is actually getting a little intense. Uh, let's see, we'll put you here. Uh, 
What if Steel Knights had celerity? That sounds awful. <laughs> that sounds horrible. <laughs> Let's not do that. Alright, so we're in turn 20, 10 now. And we're halfway. We do actually kind of need to hurry it up a little bit, but I think we'll be okay. Bro, 1 HP recover. Hey, man. I want to be on full health, okay? Wow, 7 damage Thoron. I didn't really need to worry. Oh, let's go, Darius. Will we see Flesh and Bones Ahmed? Not likely now. Is PH short for Philippines? <laughs> yes, he's actually not French. He's from the Phil Philippines. That's... Oh my god, that would have been a kill. You see this shit? You see this shit? Oh, nice. C-rank light magic. Man, I really neglected Lilinat's training. Holy shit. Oh, it's time for John Sweep. John Sweep, let's go. John on the throne. Come on, get a crit. Come on, sweep, sweep. Yes! Sweep! Sweep! The PH stood for <laughs> That's funny. Oh, why is that funny? Mangs, how would you feel if Andran Saga 1 ended up ended in chapter 14 and the sequel will be continuing chapter 15 to 31 instead of the huge game we have? This was actually something we did dis like discuss, like whether or not we would split Andran Saga into two ROMs. We, uh, we decided not to do that. Uh, I think it would have been a worse experience. Oh, what the I think it would have been a poorer experience overall. I don't think that would have been. I don't think that would have made the game more memorable. I think it would have made it less memorable. What the fuck? Oh my god! He just got status cured of his fire chan. That is that is hilarious. <laughs> I just cured my own ring status. I just cured my own freaking ring status. That is so funny. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. If you stand on a throne, you lose your ring status. It's actually pretty funny. Uh, I don't actually know if Aubrey can reach the treasure in time. But I'll use the Peshkots. Let's see, maybe I'll get a... Maybe I'll get a lethality. Yep, I did. Okay, so now, okay, I don't get it. When she uses Peshkots, her lethality crits are normal, but not when she uses her dagger? Question mark? Question mark? What? That doesn't make any sense. I don't get it. Why would they work? Why would they work like that? I don't get it. Why would they? Why would they work like that? No crits for you. I don't like this crit chance. I really don't. Oh, you know what? It's time for you guys. Everyone's favorite animation. You know what time it is. Why is Aisha with a hammer? Uh, she just kind of had it from the last chapter. <laughs> There's not really any good reason for it. She just, she just did. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm not. I'm not gonna do that. That's just stupid. Ele epilepsy time. Let's go. Since you can pay Aubrey for her service, an assassin, does she also provide other services? Go to Horny Jail. Do you think Caroline can take on a whole retinue of Steel Knights on her own with the Claymore? I think she can. I think she can quite easily. Let's go.
Claymore is a balanced weapon, you guys. It's a balanced regalia. Of course, it does mean I'll have to face Corvus in the final battle, which I'm not looking forward to. That guy has Devil's Luck. Yeah, he has Devil's Pact. Uh, which does not sound very fun to go up against. Okay, what if I just use a Fenrir on this guy? Can I double him? No? Dulam? 17 times 2. That's not enough, is it? No, it's not. Can I not set this kill up for Darius? Really? Can I not set this kill up for Darius? 17 times... This will not kill Varg, will it? I'm pretty sure this does not kill Varg, right? This doesn't kill Varg, right? 51. Cool. Fifty-one damage. Okay, thank you. I just wanted to make sure, you know? Right, these Thoron Steel Knights are incredibly scary. Just Void Flare, bro? Your champ for still going even after game over? Excuse me? Uh, what? What are you talking about? Oh, fuck, this guy's an aura. Shit. Even after game over? Excuse me, mister? I, I never got a game over. Alright, Darius has hit level 20. See the final character to hit level 20? I think so. Nice, look at that. 21. He's slow as balls. What the hell? Yeah, look at that. Capped out Darius. He's very slow. He's very slow, what the hell? Alright, we actually have to be a bit cautious here, because this is getting a little scary. Um, so I think what I'm going to do first and foremost is... Can I kill this guy? Uh, I probably can. Yeah, I can. You game over five times. Oh, I thought he meant in this season. Oh, uh, did I just Manx Math? I think I just Manx Math, you guys. Oh my god, I'm <laughs> Manx Math! No! Oh no. Oh no, I'm Manx Math. Okay, she's not in range of anyone else, though, thank goodness. Why do you keep doing this? Because I'm tired, that's why. It's okay, you guys. It's okay. We'll be fine. Yeah, I don't know why Helga just straight up refuses to get... But uh, one thing is for sure, though. I probably need to get away from this guy. Oh, he has a Brave Axe. Yeah, I'm not fucking with that. I am not fucking... Actually, I think Sorry isn't level 20 yet. Mine's... will hit the turn limit? No, 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 I will not. I will absolutely not hit the turn limit. Yeah, at least I got the Ragnarok this time, am I right? That's worth something. Also, I just realized the Claymore is a sword, so the Steel Knights will just two-range her. You missed the Kanto proc. Oh, you just gotta open the door by date, by turn 20. It's not... It's not a problem. Alright, John, you gotta sweep this. Let's see if he sweeps this. Man's careful. One wrong move and we're back to rambunctious reunion. <laughs> No. Oh, let's go, Steel Knight Cred. Oh, that's a scary guy, Aura. Ooh, here we go. Alright, can Aubrey... I mean, once I engage Galad, I guess Aubrey can do her thing, but... Yeah, I'll go over here. She has Lock Touch, so she can open that door. And I think I will grab a chest key with Theodore. And I will go and open the treasury over there. 
Not too close, though. Sure, let's go. Claim more time. Crit, maybe? Oh my goodness, this woman. Are Steel Knights promoted from generals or their own classes? Um, Steel Knights are kind of like a unique case. I mean, Isabelle promotes from a general to a Steel Knight. They are basically tier 3 classes. That's what they are. They are super generals. Manx, I'm making the beta tester battle. Do you want the Vor tile set? I mean, I don't know, man. The Vor tile set. Yeah, this guy could end Jaka's career, couldn't he? Yeah, he could. Ooh, nice crit dog. Let's go. La la la. Alright, and then let's just use the Ubunga Bali. Oh my god, he doubles with the Ubunga Bali. What the fuck? What happened to this guy? Albert would have been super good here, not gonna lie. Oh, he's amazing. You can bring a base level Albert to this battle, and he'll get job done. That's how strong he is. Like, he does, like, 50 damage to the Steel Knights, like, at level 1. So it's super easy to give him kills. He's gonna get a lot of experience. Like, if you didn't give Albert a single level, you still bring him for this. Alright, you know what? Just in case we need extra help, I'm sending Jocko this way. I don't think we will, though. We got some Steel Knights here that we gotta kill, and my aura is broken, so that's terrifying. Um, that is actually a little scary. We got a lot of Steel Knights coming this way. Um, yeah, that is actually pretty scary. My team isn't okay. 20, 40, 60, 80 from Helga. I mean, can we rely on her to get at least one crit? That would be nice. Alright, well, eight turns left. Yeah, I'm starting to get a little... Not worried, but, you know, like, hmm... Nice. Saving some Ragnarok uses. Good job, Helga. Now, sadly, she cannot... I am sad to say that she cannot proc Gale for us multiple times. That would have been really cool. Alright, let's go, Chicken Tendies. You go. Crit here would be amazing. Oh, please, Chicken Tendies. Tendy passive? Yeah, I will. That's why I'm bringing him in right now. Ah, crit here would be so nice. Cyrus, let's go. Come on. Get a crit. Yeah! Let's go! Yeah, multiple Gale Force procs would be absolutely stupid. I agree. Why would be? Oh, this is nice. I think this is a guarantee. This is probably not a guaranteed kill, but I hope it is. Is this a kill? No, it's not actually. Never mind. Finally, she starts critting. This guy has a brave axe. That's fine. One, two, three, four. Yeah, we'll actually dance for tendies. Off by 3 HP. It's okay. You can always count on a lucky crit. And then I'll put 10 Ds right here. Ooh, 23. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I think I will actually put 10 Ds here. And then just... He has a Fenrir, but I don't think it should be a problem. 50... He does 50 damage. I think I'll just put him here. One, two, three, four, five. They have five move, right? Yeah, they have five move. So I'll, I'll put Tendis here, and we'll be fine. Oh, I still had Lilinat. There was nothing to worry about. 
there was absolutely nothing to worry about. Banking on crits is a bad idea. It's how I've beaten countless Iron Mans and failed countless others. Sorry, might get it. No, she's fine. Sorry's fine. Sorry has 50 HP. She's not gonna die, you guys. It's fine. John sweep, John sweep, let's go get a crit, 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 crit. Yeah, <laughs> I love this man. He suddenly turned into a very good combat unit. I think every single one of my... Oh, hi there. Yeah, see, this is fine. Uh, I think the only character that hasn't reached level 20 yet is sorry. So I'll have a full team of level 20s, which is nice. And I'll have an Eternal Seal to give away. I don't know who I should give that one to. Uh, I think it doesn't matter that much at this point. Um, but I do actually kind of need to start moving here, so... Yeah, I think this this world might be faster, maybe? Aubrey? Sure? Talk to Coulter for lethality. Coulter died 20 maps ago, my friend. Okay, let's see. We have these guys with aura. Maybe John will get the kill. That'd be nice. Nice. Let's go. Give it to John. He needs to speak. I'm thinking. Oh, nice. He hit level. He hit S rank. That's actually really nice. That's extra crit for him. Look at that. Cultures, cultures are dust nut. Yeah, he's dust by now, pretty much. I think Aubrey would probably be the best candidate. Yeah, probably. You're probably right. Alright, so I think what I'm gonna do... Okay, no one can pick up chicken tendies. But maybe I'll pick up John. Oh, wow, John is too fat. What the hell? John is... The king is too fat for his armor. I think Aubrey might not be a bad choice now. Huh, sorry, it's level 17. Don't think she's gonna cap out in this chapter. I would be very, very, very surprised if she did. You know what? I think this will be faster. I think it'll be faster to two rage these guys. Aubrey has 980% combined growth. That is actually pretty funny. Alright, let's go and uh, bully this commander right here. What does he have? He has... Master Lance and Bolganoni. I think we can begin... We can begin the process of humiliating him with Aisha. Let's go. Alright, let's begin the bullying. I don't think she will actually kill this guy. Aubrey should have a Jaka as support. Aubrey had supports to begin to... Aubrey had supports, but sadly, we just didn't have the space to implement them all. Maybe once the B PH rebuild comes along, we'll look into it. I want Aisha to humiliate me. I'm sure you do. Oh my goodness, he can crit Caroline, what the fuck? Okay, this was actually a little scary, I don't know if I like this. Uh, I think her lucky seven has worn off by now. Yeah, okay, this is a little bit scary actually, I don't like this. Boogie supports with... Support stay Aubrey and Ash support. Yeah, sorry about that. I mean, I, I feel terrible about it. I really do. I didn't make this decision lightly. Some eternal seal. What about Theo, though? 
What about Theo for an Eternal Seal? He actually has not... Oh, he has capped speed, actually. Hmm. Remove Miriam altogether? What a terrible thing to say. Miriam is a cool character. Aubrey Eternal Seal. I mean, sure, why not? I mean, she's right next to Jaka. Although, I don't want to slow down. Oh my god, Aisha just broke her hammer. What the hell? Theo is mediocre. He might need it. This commander is ridiculously tough to kill. Miriam is okay, but her growths compared to Ash sucks, no offense. I mean, Ash is a better unit, there's... There's no denying this, but that doesn't mean Miriam isn't good. Oh, very nice. I'll be sure to make good use of it. I think so, too. And she's also easier to level up with Lethality. Alright, this will be a kill, thanks to Chivalry, which is nice. Maybe he'll get a crit on me, that'd be funny. Hey, Manx, I remember you said the original ending. You wanted to give Andron Saga different. What was the original idea? Everyone dies in Chapter 27. Literally. 29. Everyone dies in Chapter 29. Literally. Literally, everyone. They just die. Bad ending. Not joking. I'll let Aubrey kill this guy, I think that's more fun. Chivalry is based on the enemy's HP. Oh, yeah, right. Uh, why, though? Um, I thought it was fun. I thought it was a subversion of expectations. Everyone loves that, right? It's like, haha, you didn't expect that, did you? Here's a shitty ending. Ooh. I mean, that not that what Hollywood does these days when they want to write a quote-unquote good story? Oh, hello! <laughs> oh! Oh, Caroline fires back, though. King sure is taking a sweet time. He should have been there by now. Yeah, that's your cue to hurry up. Alright, 50 out of 20 turns, this is fine. Alright, so I think, yeah, let's just give this to Aubrey, why not? Why not? There we go, it should be quite easy for her to cap strength and all of her other stats now. Yeah, no. <laughs> Definitely not. Why is Jokka's- I don't know. I, that's probably a bad idea on my end, isn't it? I'll send Sari down there to dance for him so he can... I don't know, I thought maybe they need some help, but yeah, it's dumb. I shouldn't have done this. You lost the secret objective? I sure did. Five turns left, you're running out of time? No, I'm fine. Five turns is a long time, my friend. It's a long time. Manx, that would be awful. Why do you think of that? Yeah, I mean, it's the reason we didn't go with it. Oh, Hamern, hi. Ooh, a Hamern. Hmm. A Hamern. Hmm. What should I Hamern, I wonder? I have a lot of things that I'd like to Hamern. Daybreak might honestly not be too bad. 9 out of 10 turns remaining, Mangus. Oh, I'm fine. Yeah, yeah. Go get him, Mowbray. Bonk. Tendaris' magic stone has one use left. Hmm. Daybreak vanishes on chapter 31. That's a good point, actually. It does. I like the idea of everyone dying in Chapter 9, but God, I would have hated it at the same time. Yeah, there's, as I said, there is a reason we didn't go with that. Yeah, I should not have earned the Daybreak, absolutely. 
Um... I hate being temporary banned for being cringe. I wouldn't I wouldn't complain about it. PH might ban you again. I'd say yeah, the Ugaba Uga Babali or Ragnarok might be. Yeah. The Ugunda Bali or the Ragnarok would probably be a good idea, yeah, I agree. Ooh, nice crit. Let's go. Alright, look, we're gonna get Galahad just in time. It's not gonna be any problems at all. Everything is just dandy. Now, Galahad will still be a rough fight. There's no doubt about that. But, I have the Claymore. I think I'll be okay. In your opinion, what is the best weapon in the game? Uh, either the Gale Shot... Either the Gale Shot or... Honestly, the, the Dawn Call is pretty damn good. Mangs, in your opinion... Uh... Chapter 10, any representations of the 2020 riots? You mean those riots who never happened? I'm earning the Magic Stone? I don't know if the Magic Stone is that good, to be honest. Alright, let's get Jokai in here together with, uh, with Sari. What's the settings on the emulator to run so smoothly? You gotta go to frame skip zero. There's a lot of things you can do to enhance your emulator. I talk about a few of them. Alright, here we go. It's time to fight Galachad. We're gonna try to split up the Steel Knights as much as possible. Alright, uh, probably shouldn't trigger it this turn, though. We should wait until we're closer. We're on turn 17 out of 20, so... We probably don't want to hold off on too long, but... Minus you big at the process, were peaceful. Of course they were. Oh, another Eternal Seal. Holy shit, I didn't, I didn't remember you got two of them. Who should I give the other one to? Wait, who should I give the other one to? And the boots! Oh, the boots should probably go to Jacka though. Uh, Aubrey again? No, she doesn't need 10 levels, you guys. She doesn't need 10 levels, come on. Uh, Theo, probably, or Cyrus? No, I'm not giving boots to Cyrus, give me a break. Uh, I, I'm thinking Sorry honestly benefits from the boots. Don't you think so? Okay, you know what? I think we'll just activate him right now. I, I don't wanna... I don't wanna fuck around. Well, I'll be damned. You made it. You truly are an impressive bunch. Brother! Femke, get out of there. You better get let her go. Alright, running all along now, little one. It's time for the adults to play. And now the true battle can begin. I hope you're all ready to die. All remaining Steel Knights to me. Let's go down in a blaze of glory. Oh boy. You're no longer on a time requirement. So we got two commanders here. With... Master Lances. Ooh, you, you. We got another guy with a Master Lance. Uh, ooh, 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 ooh. Uh, how much damage do they do? 43. We'll let Dawn have a crack at them. And we'll let uh, Cyrus have a crack at this guy. I don't have sorry in range. That's not great. Theodore is in range. I know. I'll try not to have him be in range. 
Wait, with Galahad dead, everyone from House Steel will be dead, right? In the in my ending, yeah. House Steel just goes extinct, yeah. It's kinda sad. But it's it's what happens. Okay, Galahad is going to the right. That is not great, actually. <laughs> that is actually not fantastic. Get Omni in range? Yeah, yeah, I will. That 1% crit. It wouldn't have killed me, I'm pretty sure. No, it wouldn't. What does Galahad have no children? Is he stupid? He can't. He literally cannot. The commander of the Steel Knights cannot marry or have kids. It's not because he doesn't want to. He can't. Galakokka. Galahad's impotence. I mean... You never know the real reason, but, like, on paper... Alright, come on, Jaka. Yeah, let's go! Crit, 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 crit! Crit, crit! He cut off his balls as he took the job. He gives the Eternal Seal to Theo? Um, hmm. I'll have to think about it for the final battle. This is not a kill. No, Tundaris fucks this guy over. Got him. I'm thinking probably Darius. I'm not sure. We'll, we'll have to see. We will have to see, ladies and gentlemen. Isn't Amon have steel? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. This this is true, actually. I mean, technically. I mean, he's a Lightbringer, but yeah. I mean, technically, House Steel would live on Draymon. This is true. Ugh. Ugh. What the fuck? Oh, God. Kill this guy. Kill this man. Crit this man. What, Hanako? What? What? What, Hanako? What? What? Why are you yelling my name? Blood Tide? Uh, do we just charge here? What do we do? I, I don't... I mean, to be fair, I think Caroline murders these guys with the Claymore. I don't think really anything can stop her. But at the same time, I'm also fucking terrified, so... Um... I guess as long as we have Ahmed, we're, we're good on that front. Ah, fuck it. I'll be fine. Just Galahad. Mangs, your tendies are done? What? Why? Hanako on drugs? No, she's just Brazilian. Okay, and then we'll go... Okay, how does Dawn fare against Galahad? Oh, wow, she actually does fairly well against him. I should probably get Varg out of there, shouldn't I? Oh, that's a Void Fire crit. Let's go. Oh, no, never mind. He's a commander. Oh, I see, Hanako. I see. I see. I see. Makes sense. Uh, Alright. Let's pick you up. 
Let's pick you up. And we'll put Ahmed right here. And if I'm not completely mistaken, they should both go for him. Hey, I used Kanto, guys. Are you proud of me? Aren't you proud of me, guys? I finally used Kanto. Alright, let's hope no one dies! <laughs> okay, Galahad moves first. Nice. I hope you said your prayers because your life ends here. But take some pride in the fact that it took me to kill you. Oh, that's a, that's a cred. Ooh. Yeah, that's not gonna do shit. <laughs> That's not gonna do shit, bro. That's not gonna do shit, bro. Alright. Galachad. You have lived long. Uh, let's try and make sure you get the holy symbol first before we do that, right? Wait, what? Where my holy symbol at? There you go. I don't understand, Galad. Please explain something. Hmm, what's that? You clearly have no desire to harm my mother or sister. You seem to detest injustice, so why do you serve Mortimer? I serve House Steel. Mortimer possesses my house blood. He also happens to be my king. Need I any other reasons? But why did you help him hunt down and kill Baudemon? Why? Slander. I did no such thing. I only pursued you, Jaka. In fact, Randall asked me to intervene in your conflict. I told him no, I would never harm an ear of House Steel. You're being pedantic. Pandantic. Bodemon died, and you assisted in that. If it weren't for bastards like you, I'd still have my brother. I'm so sorry for what happened to Bodemon. Truly, I am. He would have made a fine king. But all the same, Mortimer isn't the villain you claim him to be. I'm the youngest of Maria's boys. I'm glad the youngest of Maria's boys won the battle. In another life, perhaps I might have succeeded like he did. Defend yourself all you want. I'll bring your house to ruin. I'll never forgive you for what you did to my brother. And that is your right. Alright, he is uh, debuffed. Let's see, can we... Oh, can we use Alastor on him? No. Oh, your favorite animations are back! Your, your, fa your favorite animations are back, ladies and gentlemen. Westland Odin donated $99 through Super Chat. Here is something to help with those physical cartridges. Love the story of this game and watching you play. Thank you so much. Um, a guy is currently keeping me posted. He sent me a mail today about the physical cartridges. He has now been able to start making them. He's going to send me one as a prototype. I'm going to ensure that they work. And uh, once I have it, once I confirm that it works on a GBA, I'm going to order up a bunch more. So those physical cartridges are being made as we speak, ladies and gentlemen. And they're gonna be a thing. So I'm very much looking forward to that. Alright, claim more time. Claim more time. What a stream, I know, man. I did not expect to get this far, I'm gonna be completely honest. Galahad's theme slaps. It does. Oh, it does. Uh, and then... Oh my goodness. Galahad is a very tough man to kill. How tanky is this fucker? He is the tankiest boss in the little saga. And it's not even close. You have to hit him with everything you got. We kill with Aisha. Oh no, we kill with Aubrey. That's what we do. If she can even damage him, I actually not. I don't actually don't know if she can. Aha! 
90% chance to hit though, what the hell. I think I will actually do... I will rescue... I might rescue Jaka? I can't rescue him, shit. Um... Okay. There's a chance Aubrey dies. We have to take it, right? Let's go. Let's go. <laughs> well done, you've defeated me. That was a good fight. One final risk to end the stream. One final level up for Aubrey. It was worth it, I think. Oh, let's go. And we got the bulwark, which no one no one can use. Ha <laughs> good fight. Not bad, boy. You are the superior fighter. Never thought the Steel Knights would be so hard-handedly bested. Where are my relatives? They're fine, lad. I have them waiting in the back. Don't worry, I'd never harm innocent women. Especially not the kind of girl like your sister. I always wanted a sister when I was younger. Well, at least you're not a monster like Mortimer. That boy certainly hung me out to dry, the wretch. He sent no reinforcements, even after promising me. Now that you've seen his familial love, care to roll over on him? Tell me what Mortimer's plan is. Quiet down, lad. A steel board will always keep to his word. I don't know Mortimer's grand plans, but I know where he is. He's holed himself up at the Lightbringer Lumina Shrine. I believe he's constructing a weapon of incredible power. As for the details, the brat never saw fit to inform me. How do I know you're telling the truth? I don't give a damn if you believe me. Our steel is ruined. Mortimer abandoned us. None of this nonsense matters to me anymore. Just let me bleed out in peace, Jacka. I want to make amends before I pass away. I see. In that case, I'll take my leave. Thank you for leaving my family unharmed. You're a good man, all things considered. Bah, if only for I fought only if I had fought a worthy successor for the Steel Knights, then I could have died without any worries burdening my heart. Mm, if only. Goodbye, Galahad. Shut the fuck up and let me die in peace, yeah. Thorgrim, Robert, looks like I'm the last one of us to pass. I take some pride in knowing I outlasted the both of you. I wonder what the future of House Steel looks like. Did we leave a good legacy? How will they remember us? Brother! My cute sister, I'm glad you're okay. I was scared at first, but the man in armor was nice to us. Thank you for saving Mom and I. Oh, Jaka, my brave boy, I knew you'd come for us. Mother, you look better. Your coloring's improved. A physician has been by my side ever since I got here. He's given me medicine and looked after my well-being. I was a bit puzzled by the kindness we were shown. I thought we were hostages. Jaka, what's wrong? It's nothing, Mother. I'm just happy you're both safe. That's all that matters now. I'll never leave you again. Can we go back home now? I don't like this place. You will have to stay here for a while longer, Femke. Once I've dealt with one last thing, we can go home. Then we'll live together again like a family. Just like we used to. Jaka. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. I'll save the intro and outro of 30x for the final stream. So we'll do 30x and the final battle. So, uh... Yeah! We're at the end, ladies and gentlemen. We're at the end! I'm gonna do the final chapter on, uh, Friday. Deathless stream! I, I was able to do it. I, I might just beat this man. Like, I might just, but chapter 31 is... Chapter 31 is ridiculous on Lunatic, so not having not having 18 units is going to be rough. Manx, add Galahad to death counter. Oh, you just you just want you just want to have a death count. You know what? Fine, fine. So I guess we don't get a deathless stream after all, do we? Alright, very quick meme review. I'm very tired. This has been a very long stream. I'm very grateful to you guys, though. It's been a great stream. My goodness, this has been a fun stream. I never thought I'd do Chapter 29 Deathless. I thought the stream would end right here. I'm so happy that I'm still in it. Chapter 31 is going to be really rough, though. It might, I might not be able to do it. That chapter is a... On Lunatic, it's a special kind of hell. There are just so many ads, and it's designed around having 18 units, and I only have 15. Oh, what the fuck? Hmm. 
so um, I'm kind of what the fuck? Why am I getting errors? What? Is my hard drive full? No. Interesting. I got like errors when trying to download memes. I'm not entirely sure why, but I think I download. Yeah, I got them. Too many memes. If you touch a single hair on her head, we will be wearing your guts like a Pashima Aruna gang. <laughs> uh, she's already dead. Jackpot Casino. <laughs> Jackpot Casino. Helga crit rate when she quads. No, I don't think I will. <laughs> the 300 bots after finally getting unbanned. That's great. La Theodore Lawn. Theodore Lawn on Cheroline. Thanks, I hate it. I fucking hate it. Drip Dart. What is this? What is this? Uh, what are these shitty memes, man? A PRH map. Great map design. The world's worst gimmick. <laughs> oh, it's a rod drawing. It's punished rod, ladies and gentlemen. T Lord donated 10 euros. Congrats once again for the Deathless stream. I would have never bet on you five hours ago, but here you did, but it was impressive. Thank you. I do have a tendency to focus a lot more when I'm on the ropes, and I think this, like, I'm really happy with beating Chapter 29. I did not expect to do that. So, but again, the biggest challenge is yet to come. I would say Chapter 31 on Lunatic is easily harder than Chapter 29. Much, much, much harder. There's so many things that can go wrong. If I get the fucking Bolting Mortimers, or the status staff Mortimers. Hopefully, I'll get the, the the damaged Mortimers because fighting the the bolting Mortimers and the status staff Mortimers are gonna wreck me because I don't I might not have the numbers to kill them all, and that can snowball really fast. So I am very 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 scared. Mangs, please stop the stream. I don't want to watch Alistor again. <laughs> Me when I find pH. How many frogs have you eaten in your life? Well, that's right. The French do do that. All right, let's begin the bullying. We gotta bully more. When chapter chat when chapter starts. When the chapter is almost done. On the last turn of the chapters. Memes. Yeah. Sometimes I think you guys just tune in for the memes. You're not interested in gameplay. You're just sitting there waiting for memes. Yeah. Let's go. Never punished. Oh, what's this? <laughs> Chat after watching. Oh, that's funny. Chat after <laughs> watching Theodore use Alistair 40 times after Adam and Alistair Brock. That's funny. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, super quick Q&A. Mega quick Q&A, and then I'm going to bed. Like, mega super duper quick. Like, maybe just one question Q&A. That's how quick this Q&A is going to be, because it's freaking 2 a.m. and I'm tired. Clever Travis asks, Mengs, why weren't there any playable units from House Ring? Why weren't there any playable units from House Ring? What? Are you shitting me? Why are there not playable this mofo really play through the entirety of Andron's saga without realizing who Kurt and Haley were? I guess so. I mean, I mean, I mean, I guess, I guess it's easier to overlook if you like lose one of them. You don't get the scene. I mean, I guess. I mean, I can see how you'd play through the game without really knowing that they're from House Ring, because if one of them dies, you don't get the scene where Kurt takes off his bandana. And in Haley's like description, it doesn't say anything about House Ring, but like she's blonde and a sniper, you can kind of like. She, she does look like Liam and Gabriel, you can kind of figure it out, I guess. But yeah, I mean, that's... Today you learned, I guess. Hanako says hi. That's not a question, Hanako. Time out now. <laughs> Elka Saras, Mangs, is Galahad Sprite based on Cephiel's? Yeah, they're alternate Cephiel animations from the repo. We didn't make them. We didn't make them. They're like alternate Cephiel animations with armor, basically. You see, the Cephiel animation from FE6 is really weird. You can't really port it over to FE7 or FE8. It breaks the ROM. Uh, it's specially coded to work in FE6, but in FE7 and FE8, it's too long for their ROM. It doesn't know how to process it. 
Uh, like, he spins around a bunch, and it just breaks. Like, you can try and importing it, it, it'll, it won't work. For that reason, a lot of people have been making custom Cephiel animations so that people can put them into other games. Tal also asks, do you prefer happy endings or more dramatic endings, and why? Um, Chad is gonna ruin that question. Um, I am a big fan of Bittersweet. Like, that's always been my favorite kind of ending. Uh, Bittersweet, like, it's kind of sweet, but it's also, there's also a sadness to it. I think Bittersweet is the best kind of ending, where it's like, it's good. Like, you can have, like, look, you can have a really happy ending, too. I think Lord of, uh, Lord of the Rings is definitely Bittersweet when you think about it, but Lord of the Rings is also a very happy ending. A happy ending is justified after a very good story. Whereas, in a more dramatic story, you probably want, with more stakes, you probably want a bittersweet ending. Rananana says, will there be guidance chapters in the prequel of Andoran Saga? Um, I'm still not sure about that. There might be a few, yeah. Brandon Williams asks, how many downloads have Andoran Saga reached? Uh, I don't know. I don't know if we can measure that, but the Discord has close to... I think the Discord has, like, does it have almost 8,000 people in it by now? So that's pretty impressive. Hmm? Seven and a half thousand people in the Discord, which is pretty damn impressive, which means that, I mean, maybe not everyone who joins have played it. Let's say half has played it. That's still pretty impressive. That's still 3,500 people who played Andoran Saga. So, and maybe it's more than half? I mean, I don't know. Anyone, everyone who joins Discord may not necessarily play it. Maybe one, maybe like two-thirds. So like 5,000. I think it's probably, maybe aside from the last promise, maybe the most played ROM hack. Maybe the most played Fire Emblem ROM hack. I don't think any other. I don't think any other ROM hack except for the Last Promise can really overtake it in terms of how much it's been played. But then again, that is because I'm using my whole channel to advertise it. So that that, that doesn't necessarily. Oh, it's so it's so good. Like oh, it's been played by so many people because it's so good. No, it's been played by so many people because I have a big audience and I'm broadcasting it. But I'd like to think that it's a, a good ROM hack as well. Ufas, will there be what comes next after YouTube for you? Will you be doing this forever? <laughs> this is something me and Bethany talks about a lot. Like, what will we do? Uh, like, will I keep doing YouTube forever? I see myself doing YouTube as a side gig for as long as it's feasible for me to do it. But I think, especially after I have kids, I might be looking for some more stable forms of income. I probably might do more regular job. But, like, I don't see why I would ever stop. Like, I will do YouTube for as long as you can be asked to watch me. You know, maybe I'll log in one day and there will be like zero people viewing my live stream because like it's boring and I'm like, okay, maybe it's time to hang up the, maybe it's time to have it, hang it up, you know, that could very well happen. I mean, everyone falls off eventually, right? No Jagan lasts forever, but I'd say as long as I have an audience and as long as I can upload a video every now and then, I don't see why I wouldn't continue doing it. Uh, I might go back to just doing Let's Plays and just focus on being a dad, I don't know. We'll see. It's very difficult to say, but so far I am loving YouTube, and YouTube is a good revenue, so I'd be kind of stupid to give it up, and I'm not tired of it yet. I mean, every single stream I have so much fun, so and I've done this for how many years now? And there'll be a new Fire Emblem game, always be a new Fire Emblem game on the horizon, so do Let's Plays with your kids? I don't know if I'd do that, but no, no. Bethany's saying no, no. She ref she's like, no. Uh, would I play Fire Emblem with my kids, though? Like, all, on our own? Of course, of course, of course. I'm looking forward, I'm looking forward to seeing them. I'm looking forward to seeing the them cry when Sigurd gets barbecued by Argus. It's gonna be great. Maybe I'll film it and, and upload it on TikTok. No, no. <laughs> anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I think I got a, I think I got a donation, but it hasn't shown up yet. Toxic streamer, you bet. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I love you guys. You guys have been great. This has been a hell of a stream. Appreciate all your support. Since you deleted your ban list in the final chapter, will Mortimer summon all of his banned alts and start chanting, Nell is excessively gorgeous in chat? <laughs> oh, do you guys remember the Nell guy when I was streaming the reboot camp? Nell is gorgeous, Nell is gorgeous, Nell is gorgeous, ban. Create new account. Nell is gorgeous. Nell is gorgeous. Nell is good. That was that was that was hilarious. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I will see you guys on Friday with the final stream. Unless I die, in which point we'll go back.
to see Snape. Fuck. I don't want that to happen. That would really break me. Friday, guys. High stakes stream. Shit. I'm nervous. Good night. I love you guys. Bye.